Yes, good morning, good morning, everyone. This is Mega Comrade. Uh, live from Dallas, Texas. Uh, today's date is uh, Thursday, October 7, 2021, at about 10.52 a.m. in Dallas, Texas, uh, which is going to be about uh, 4.52 p.m. Nigeria time and 5.52 p.m. Italian European time. As you understand, today is going to be Dengue Dengue. You are all welcome to PFN Situation Room, Royal Barrow, between Obaseki last month, standing Apostle Alfred Odio Unyinosa, and Edo State PDP Mobilizing Coordinator, Comrade Bob Manuel Umaru. Uh, that being said, uh, before I bring them in, I want everyone to go ahead and share this video. Let's see how far we can go with it. Then we will go ahead and bring them in. Everyone need to invite their friends, their well wishers, tag your friends to come to PFM Situation Room. We are going to be talking about the dual state development situation, insecurity, and others today. However, on one west and on one east is the main focus right now as we embark on uh, the moment of truth on um, People's Freedom Movement television YouTube channel. We are going to be broadcasting live today from uh, Mega Comrade Clement Edegbe, the Tiger and the Lion Combined uh, Facebook page. Uh, People's Freedom Movement Facebook page and uh, People Freedom Movement hashtag enough is enough YouTube channel. So I want every one of you to go ahead and spread the word of freedom. Uh, that being said, I thank you all as you come. May the Lord Almighty continue to bless you and uh, bless your household. Uh, we are waiting on a uh, comrade, uh, Apostle Alfred. Uyinosa is already here in the studio, live with us. And uh, we are waiting on uh, Comrade Bob Umaro. Thank you so much. Let's do the sharing. God bless you all. Thank you. It's Mr. OJ on the beat. It's nice and cute. I'm OJ. And I'm OJ and I'm I don't know you, but I don't see your work. Oh, you did suit me. We don't say where well, we they suffer, we don't offend them. We go to school, we don't graduate to, but there is no job. We try to live as a proud see, and they return us. They start to talk about the bad men for so long. Selfishness and goodness, now they kill it our economy. We are going to have our government. Tell me where they call the lie about the power men. I don't wish to tell them. Let them stop all their greediness. As they see me, so I know they fear them. Because this is what they do, do with the see them. They are all the man of the gold. We are the people. We know the truth. We know surrender. But we are the people. For me, they walk, for both they jump out. They are the people. They know they don't see way to my grace. But we are the people. I'm 
God bless you. God bless you once again. This is Mega Comrade. Uh, hello, Apostle Alfred Uyinosa. How are you doing right. today? <laughs> yes, I'm fine. As you can see by the grace of God. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Okay, good. Uh, hey, guys. Uh, we have a uh, uh, Apostle Alfred Uyinosa, I think I call it right this time. The last yes, man standing yes. with Governor Godwe Obaseki. Uh, you know you are the last man standing with Governor Godwe Obaseki. There are people still standing, you know. People still there but this time. You are, you are the last man standing, uh, you know, working for him, doing any, everything for him possible. Uh, whatever you can do, you are doing it. You are the only one we are seeing now. The rest of them... They are already SET, Exodus, movement of the people. Go ahead. <laughs> it is well. Yeah, thank you very much, my, my pa, my pa, and I appreciate you for the privilege uh, you've granted to me to be on this, uh, I call it a uh, situation room, where we will talk and as it be. Okay. I appreciate you. <laughs> I appreciate you and I appreciate all your fans. Uh, now make a dog great. Now make now everybody they fight for, and they will not feel turn everywhere to uh, turn out the forest to snake snake. Because if we turn everywhere to snake snake, there can never be development. Well, I appreciate you, my brother, a amigo, the man with the heart of gold. And I don't care what people say. I don't care. I don't care. But let's see. But let's see how we can really join together to make the state forward. Domo sir. Mm -hmm. Uh Well, well, well. Uh, the PDP uh, mobilizing coordinator, uh, you all know, the outstanding uh, comrade Bobumaro, <laughs> is still apostle. You know, sir, so have blown the, the native powder and uh, his, his hook is somewhere. So we are waiting for him. Uh, the prayer of apostle, you know, sir, have already started working already. <laughs> we just pray he made it. Uh, so people cannot see that apostle. You know, sir, nobody mess with him. When you mess with him, uh, God of apostle, you know, sir, we we know what to do. So right now, <laughs> for some reason, we are waiting for him. What do you have to say about your powder? Let's get back to your about your Bible powder. <laughs> <laughs> it just a uh, it's a spiritual understanding. It's a spiritual understanding and uh, following the pattern of God, and that's all. Okay. Uh, well, before he gets here, uh, he's coming. He's coming. So uh, we are going to talk about... Uh, I want you to tell us the truth of the situation in a do state generally. Uh, go ahead. Concerning insecurity. Yeah, good evening, everyone. And uh, first of all, I am not a politician. I do not belong to any political party. I am just a man on a divine assignment. And my role in governance is to bring sanity to the system. Anywhere we sanity it wrong, we talk him as it be. Anywhere we sanity it right, we talk him as it be. I think make it clear the air first, so I don't be a politician. 
I have not joined any political party. Well, by the grace of God, the situation right now in a door, everything is okay by the grace of God. God help us. Of course, insecurities all over the country, all over the world. But for a door, I think uh, things are getting better by the day, by the grace of God. Okay, so tell us about yourself. Today is the first day you are appearing on a PFM situation room. Uh, we want to know more about you. Can you go ahead and tell the, the innocent positives all over the world uh, who is uh, Apostle Alfred Uyinosa uh, and uh, how you become what you are today? Yeah, by the grace of God, my name is Sirime Apostle Odion Uyinosa, a.k.a. Toka Masibi, or no shaking. And God had blessed me with a beautiful wife and a wonderful children. You know, I've been to Bible school and I have my preaching lessons. Yes, ordained. I have my preaching lessons. And, uh, and I'm, an, I'm a builder, architect by profession. Outside ministry, I still get my handwork, which is the architectural drafting and I'm also into building construction. And I also have a company which they call Ghost Time Innovation. God's time innovation registered with the, uh, with the Nigerian government. Uh, by the grace of God, this is just me. I don't have a father anymore. I lost my dad at a very tender age. Then my mom, she's doing well. She's still alive. And I have younger ones all around me. I am the first son, and uh, God has been helping us. And uh, that's it. And uh, life has not been sweet, but with God on our side, things have been okay with God on our side. So Amen. we don't think evil against people. So whoever that think evil, it will always backfire. But so far, so good. God has been my backbone. And I want to talk about uh, how I become a talker as be or supporting of Basaki. I wake up one morning, God said, Talk. As I talk, finish, He gave me the name that very day, last year. Tokam, get a Mukri Tokam as you be. Abbreviation, Tokam as you be. And that was how we started. And uh, I was just doing my thing. They talk as they be for Nigeria. All our government, how did they misbehave? All our pastors, how did they misbehave? How things not really work well for our society? Of course, the traditional ruler, all and all. I just did Tokam as they be. I know they add, I know they remove, I know they fear anybody. I only fear God. I fear no soul, but I respect also. I fear nobody, but I respect everybody. So, uh, all of a sudden, Obaseki came into the scene. I have never supported any politician in my life. Apart from former President Gulok, he been a Jonathan that I prayed for. And God actually revealed it to me that he's going to lose that election. So, I knew that he's going to lose the election. So, I didn't bother myself much. So, when Obaseki came in, I just did my own, a man on the street doing his outreach. I also have an outreach called Heal Our Land, O oh Lord, Global Prayer Movement. It's a, it's, a, it's a mandate God also gave to me to be praying for Nigeria, praying for our land. And that I've been doing secretly, publicly. I've been to different markets in this town. I've been to Delta states. I've been to several places praying for the healing of the land. By the grace of God, with boldness, with power, without fear. I've been to Center of Ring Road and I speak to the power that is there. And uh, I've been to several market, Olia Market, New Benin, Salo Market, any other area. But by the grace of God, uh, God the number second came into the scene. I, I began to see some things going on in the land. I said, ah, what's going on? What's going on? With all the noise. And I it took my I took time. So I began to consult. When I hear my spirit, say support God, uh, God, uh, God, 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 say support him. Say, okay, what do I do? I began to consult. That is me. As an apostle by the grace of God, I began to consult. And I called one of my mentors, Dr. Sunday Adelaja, the pastor in Ukraine. I called him. I said, sir, this is what the Lord is laying in my heart. What do I do? He said, apostle, go ahead and support the governor publicly. Though I have been doing it uh, secretly, and I also call somebody and say, Apostle, no, 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 no. If you do that, uh, your Christian life, nobody will respect you again. No. They could say, you know, they shop government money and the rest. But I follow my mind. I follow my heart. And at the end of the day, and I came out publicly 
to support Governor Gov Obasaki. Till tomorrow, I am still supporting him, and I have no regrets in supporting him. So, this is where we are. Uh, thank you so much. God bless you. Uh, uh, well, uh, as you understand, uh, this is Mega Comrade. Uh, you might have heard a lot about me, and um, uh, what we want now is how we're going to move uh, those things forward. Election is over. We all should put politics aside and uh, work really hard and see how we can draw the attention of His Excellency Governor Godfrey Obaseki to some certain area that... Uh, uh, that are out of uh, out of order, you know. Uh, all we want is a basic uh, social infrastructure, and uh, you know, all the, the little little things that others might think is nothing might be useful to the good people of uh, those state. So, uh, while we were, are you a PDP member or APC? We want you to clear that on air today. I do not belong to any political party. Okay. Okay. I do not. I'm not a member of APC. So, you are just like, uh, are you? can you now say that you are like mega comrade, an independent man with independent minded? <laughs> I am just an independent man. <laughs> okay. 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 Before we start, can you tell us in some area that you think the Edo State Administration are supposed to be concentrating on and they are not concentrating on it? What area can you say live on air and said, look at the governor as you are watching right now because I already shared this video with him. So he might watch it later or whenever he has time, he might watch it. So can you go ahead and speak directly to the governor and say, this is the area I would have loved you to work on. And these are the area you are doing good and these are the area you are doing bad because be behind any good thing, there must be bad things. Uh, no one is perfect. So go ahead, Apostle uh, Uyeno, sir. Yeah, basically, from my own assessment, the governor is doing his best because he's a human being. And because he's a human being, you cannot expect him to be 100% perfect. Even me, I'm not perfect. So on the contrary, the governor is doing his best. He's doing his best. And uh, there are still some areas which I know he just needs to buckle up, which he's already doing, which is the area of communication communicating with the Edo people, carrying the Edo people along, telling them different plans and what they are. Those are the only, only areas. Basically, the governor is doing it, doing it best. Discover that the governor is a silent man. He doesn't talk, he doesn't talk. He's a silent man and he's a man who wants to achieve his goal and let the people wake up and see it. He's not a noise making man. So we call him wake and see. You wake up and you see good things. So these are the things we, I noticed the, the, the attributes of Governor Gordon of Basaki. He doesn't make noise with his plan. So it's a man that just do it in quietly and he's, and he's going and he's, he's doing his best. The only area I don't want him to step up is the area of communication, engaging the people, and which I know he's doing and uh, he'll continue to do his best. Okay. Uh, the only area you have problem with is communication. So you are indirectly now saying that uh, Governor Baseki is doing everything uh, that Edo people need in Edo State. Is that correct? Yes, silently. Okay. okay. Uh, before Umaro come here, we're going to ha hang that uh, topic right now. Uh, let's uh, see from fans what they are saying. Uh, I believe you can read the comment there. Uh, as you all heard yes. it, not from me, from Apostle Alfredo, you know, sir, we are not here to play got you situation. Oh, this is where we discuss. We don't do got you. Uh, oh, let me say this or ask him this to put him in trouble. You all heard him. He just said that those state is good. Uh, according to him, he said there's no area uh, that he can see that Governor Baseki is not doing good other than communication. Did I interpret it correctly? Yes, yes, as that's the only area which is communication, and he's doing his best to ensure that he, he bridging the gap. Okay, uh, let's read the first. Uh, uh, okay, hold on, let's see. I think this is the first uh, comment. He said, uh, "All this not distraction for Edo people. Is this what Edo people vote for?" Okay, Apostle Hiro, sir, that is the question for you. I don't know what that means. Okay, 
He said he don't know what that means. I think uh, your network, we are having network connection, uh, network, uh, hold on. We are having a, okay, I'm going to bring you back in. Let me do it again. Hello. Yeah, me, I'm hearing you. Okay, so it's better now. Okay, let's see. Uh, just in Governor Godney Obaseki, Ward for PDP Chairman, Ihama suspended for anti-party activity. Okay, we are having a breaking news here, Apostle Alfred. Okay, hold on. I think someone is calling for a question. Oh, I, I just cut it off. Uh, today we're supposed to be uh, civil, and uh, the way the situation is going right now. We are having a lot of breaking news uh, right now coming out from Edo State as the Edo State uh, political uh, cartels are beginning to unleash although they met in their territory. Uh, let's go ahead and pick this call. Hello. Hello, good evening, sir. Yeah, good evening. How are you? Uh, well, your name and where you are calling from? Uh, my name is, uh, I'm a victim. I'm calling from Germany to God. Okay, go ahead. Uh, please, sir, I want to ask, uh, Apostle Ilosa. I know him very well, even before he became a pastor. Okay. Uh, Apostle Ilosa, please, I want you to go to that episode of the road. The one where you video, that I say, governor, don't do, don't do a thing to look at the the road. Video that from, from the, from the junction to the head. Then you will go to uh, Old Lagos Road in Isio, that same area. You live in that same area. Go on video that old road. Then you, uh, Apostle Yerusha, you also go to your road that leads to your house in Oku. You live in, in, in Oku, opposite 7 Oku. The government is working. So you also video that road. Straight down to your road, that road that leads to Sinoko Road. Then you video that road to us in uh, Obiano East. Then you also go to a by road and video that road. I'm showing it to the uh, to the people in uh, uh, in uh, those states. You said the governor is working. Then you go to Benin Technical School Road and video that road. Then you also go to uh, a Dike Road and video that road, so that we know we that live in the diaspora, we know where the governor is working. Since we said everything is perfect, as we are talking today now, there is a uh, there, there, there is an incident that is going on along the uh, Benin Lagos Road. The full and they have taken over that road today that God is in today. So, what can you say? These people are living, there's no security. As we are talking, there's no light, there's no good, uh, 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 good health care, and you are saying the government is working. So, there's also, even before you became a pastor, I know you as an engineer, you, 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 you finished from technical school, at Pastor, you know, sir, you are uh, architect, you are doing a good uh, engineering. So please let's be uh, specific and let us be truthful. You go around and you also go to all one and build all those area and I'm sure we want to know the area where the government is working. We only have three years left. So we really want to know where the area the government is working so that we will know. Thank you. Okay. Uh Apostle Alfred Yinosa, go ahead and uh, respond. You say as we are speaking right now. Uh, Edo State, uh, Lagos Road have been taken over by Fula and AS men. You just said it a couple of minutes ago that this, the security status in Edo State is good. So what do you have to say about that? Yes, generally, you know, in Nigeria, the issue of insecurity did not start with Edo State. There is no part of this country where you do not have serious insecurity. And there is no part in this country where AS men have not taken over. So a uh, those states should not be a state to just say, ah, there's it, just insecurity in the state. I am in a those states. By the grace of God, the insecurity we are in other states is, in, in, in fact, is higher than the one we are experiencing in a those states. Let's say it the way it is, unless we are not truthful to ourselves. I'm in this town, I'm in this state. I hear what happened in other states. I hear what happened in San Francisco, another state, which is not happening in a those states. So we, 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 with what we have seen, by the grace of God, I must say kudos to the state government and uh, kudos to the uh, those state security network. And uh, I ask question, I move around. It is not everything I come on air to show or to say with what I have observed in town. The town. There has been a sign of calmness. 
Things that things, things is getting normal. Things are getting normal by the day, all like before. All like before. Whether we like it or not. And this is the truth of the matter. Now, my brother talked about the coast of the road. I should go and video a coast of the road. I said it before, I am not a politician. I am just a man doing the bidding of God, doing what God asked me to do. And I do not stand on the fence. I was in the coast of it today. I was in the coast of it today. So it, there is nothing new you want to tell me or you want to ask me about the coast of the road. I've been to a coast of the road. I saw about some few areas that I said I'm going to draw the government attention for the contractor to go back to site to amend those areas because of the high volume of erosion that was in that area. And I say it, and I saw it, which I'm going to talk about later in the day. Now we're talking about Ogun. Ogun, that is the area. I live in that area. I know the pain we are going through. But the government of the day cannot do all the road in the city. Unless we are not true to ourselves. Just as the people of is complaining, people in Bobai is also complaining. There are some villages, road in villages that have not been able to tie. We must be truthful to ourselves. Even a whole federal road in Nigeria, no road. Even federal government, they are not doing anything. So what me, I know that the government is doing its best. And even there is, the truth is this, there is no way government basically can tie the whole road in, in those states. It's not possible. Unless we are not true to ourselves. It's not possible. But what we wait is for him to do his best. If government is continuity, we are so much less to start from there. Yeah, hold on. Hello. Hello. Yes, uh, uh, we got another call. Uh, good afternoon in yeah. Nigeria. Yeah, good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Uh, I'm for you, sir. Good afternoon. God bless you. I want to comment on the issue of crime. Okay, go ahead. The issue of breaking news for me is not a breaking news because. Uh, the Edo people never wanted to listen to the truth. But today, they are seeing the truth in the, right in their power. So, if they welcome development, it's not a breaking news. Then, if we move further, I want to appreciate the Akataka promise, Akataka one of the universe for trying to make a state great, to try to correct the pressure of the people. Because so many people believe that a state can never be moved forward. But with PFM, they have big hope. So I want to thank you for that. Thank you. Before Apostle leave the studio, before we leave the station room, he has to tell us about Igoria, <laughs> Edo State College of Agriculture. Okay. Because in 2020, I know the role Apostle play. Mm. I'm from Edo State, I'm from Ovia North East, I'm from Mokbene Village. In Notuna World, in War Two. So I'm not a stranger. I my have my house in the Kewa Road, very close to Tipa Life Akiviki community. So I know all in all politics. So even Apostle to tell us about the Goreaki, okay. to tell us about the Kewa Road, because as of yesterday, when I spoke with my wife, the Kenwa Road, they are parked my car. They are using transport for school run because they don't want to put the car on the road based on the road situation. So they are using transport. And the transport is not convenient because apart from the cost, when they come home, they complain. Okay, what, their, what do you want him to yes. what do you want him to tell you about Igoria? Uh, go ahead and go straight to the question. Yeah, so that we can move Igoria, yeah. Yes, I have to be I'm a student of Igoria. I left Igoria in 2010. Okay. 
I sat in the Kogi State Asaya camp in Kaba. So I have to be frank with him. I think what I hear, the governor closed the school and promised the student future. The future has be turned to the gutters. Anything that goes to the gutters, you don't see them anymore. What I take them away. In 2020, in 20, in 2019, the governor promised to open the school. Now, in 2020, he's promising January 2021. Akure Industrial Court gave a judgment in that school. Up to today, the governor did not respect the judgment. The student who pays school fees, who pays admission fees, that come into that school when the school was closed, the money was not refunded. The academic was not given back to them. So uh, when the governor was having issue in court, he won the Supreme, the, the uh, appeal court, and won the Supreme Court. It was canceled. But other court judges that was won for the people, the governor never listened to it. The Guadalajara is part of it. Like now, the structure they have in Guadalajara today that they are building, I was in Guadalajara two weeks ago. There's no way academic can commence in January because they are still at the foundation level. So let's tell you short attitude. If the government is not doing well, let everybody say it. If he's performing, let everybody say it. Pastor, you know, sir, with due respect, I appreciate you. I love you. That my brother. As of yes, today, we are from a do state. Let's tell each other the truth. If what I hear, as of today, is no go area. Forget the structure they are putting. The structure they are putting today is not going to be a year program. As I'm talking to you now, I'm calling from Ogun State. I'm doing my PGD in Taswet, in uh, Jebo Day. In Jebo Day, there are structures they are putting, but that does not stop our academic. We still receive lectures. So closing the school that you want to beautify it, you want to make it uh, uh, more better for the people, at the end of the day, the same people are told is not the best. Where I am today, I got it from the College of Agriculture in Guarani, where I read okay. science. Okay, please make it short, please. So, uh, I want to, I, I want to conclude. Uh, yeah, uh, let me Before see. You are spoken for six. Uh, you are spoken for seven minutes. Mm, please it's let the governor know okay. that by January, if that school is not open. We are not going to block the road. We are going to do more than blocking the road. Okay. We are going to let him know that when the death in the soup is too much, the blind man will know it's not meat. <laughs> By January. The students are warming up. Okay. We that pass through the school, we are still giving them hope. We are still telling them. Okay. To, Seven to minutes. Uh, God bless you, Kola. Uh, we have to move on now. You have spoken for more than seven Thank minutes. You. Thank, you. Thank you. All right. Uh, uh, Ap Apostle Alfred Uyenosa, uh, unfortunately, I don't know what you did with your chalk, with your Bible chalk, white chalk. Uh, Comrade Umaru, uh, it's nowhere to be found. And, uh, I'm defended. And, uh, I, I, but shock, rather, I'm shocked, very shocked. To see someone who will uh, let me let, let me answer this call first before we go further. <laughs> Apostle, you know, sir, is a wonder man. Uh, go ahead, caller. Hello. Yes. Good evening. Yes. Good evening. Yeah. Good evening, my brother. Yeah. God bless you, comrade. Comrade. God bless you, comrade. Go ahead. Apostle, you know, sir. Mm. God bless you, my brother. Amen. Amen. Uh, first of all, the apostle, I want to pray yes. for you. Okay. He wants to pray for you. you. You are a man of God. Mm -hmm. but I want to beg you. Mm -hmm. If you see where the governor is also doing well, 
come out and also say it. Now, Amawe governor and winner is working. But how do you assess a man that is working? How do you assess a failure? You have to first of all find out how much is coming in monthly. Then compare with the work going on across the state. That is the best way to assess who is working. So don't say, don't come on air and be telling people the government is working here. Working. I'm not, we have 18 local government. There are some local government. There's no fed, there's no state president. No work is going on in the entire local government. But during the election, the governor will attend those local government and go the company seeking for votes. Am I not even there at all? Don't, don't, don't get it wrong. The man is not doing enough. You are in Benin. You are educated. You and I know that we touch security. No governor, no government can achieve much. Neighborhood watch the vigilante. Has the governor given them one billion era since the commencement of that vigilante? Do you know how those boys, do you know how those guys buy their bullets? How they fold their car? How they move from point A to point B? They need to be encouraged. The governor is not doing enough. He has less than three years to go. What legacy is he leaving behind? If I was a supporter of the government before the election, I would be in the forefront of those condemning him now. Because I love my state. So don't come on there and be telling I don't know if you were telling lies. Don't be telling me the people that the government is working. They are not saying it's not working. Okay, come to the heart of GRO now, the big city now, the, the main place now. Let it rain for only 10 minutes. There is flood all over the, 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 the place. And you say the governor is working. The governor should buckle up. If you are not aware, there is breaking news now. He still suspended people. A PDP in a day by no death. Was one that suspended in a day. Many of you will show money. It was in APC, there was a problem. Was money, man. They don't want me to work. They want me to share this money. Now they are showing PDP that is still fighting them. So we are. We, so those who have their brains in touch, you know that this man is the problem, not the party. You can't be a party, eh? Problem. Party B, problem. Are you a saint? You should go to a home party now. You should focus on governance and forget party structure. Except he wants to be on that godfather. You should leave party to party and walk and leave legacy. And go away and put his name down so that people will talk about him years to come. So then we are just talking about Ali. We should talk about Ali. What is he leaving behind? He's fighting party structure. It's a pity. I want to please be upright. The government is working, but the government is not doing enough. If you write an exam and you score 30% out of 100, you are a failure. So the government is a failure. Let's put it straight. It should buckle up. It should be a servant leader. We are here to correct him. I'm not, I don't believe in party. I'm not a party person. I want, the, I want development in my state. That's my interest. So I'm not talking for APC. I'm not talking for PDP. So please, Apostle, if you want me to continue loving you, at, 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 at times, come out in the open and say, where well, the government is working in the area, uh, they have no commerce working this other side. Fine. Just like you said, the government can, we don't expect the government to work across the entire state, fix all the bad roads. No. But we should see the majority of the work being going on. Crisis is coming now, October, November, December, January. This man will not utilize it. Nothing will happen. Oh. Oh, they cut you off. Uh, I think they cut a comrade off. It will be uh, sorry about that. Hello, hello, yeah. Your name and where you call it from? Well, this is can you hear me? Yeah, your name and where you are calling from, sir. Any TV from the UK, okay, okay, go ahead. I just want to beg Apostle. Mm -hmm. I just want to beg Apostle, he should please not defend the thing our Lord Jesus Christ cannot even defend. Okay. He should try as much as possible to maintain his integrity because three years of Basaki will go. He will always remain with us. Let him not spoil his image. That is what I'm begging him. Okay. Please don't spoil your image. If you think it is not working properly, say it. But there's a way you can politely say it without offending or perfectly 
and at the same time of saving the people of Benin. Make not to say after Obaseki come out, we will try you. That is why I'm begging you now. Okay? That's all I have okay. for uh, you. Uh, thank you. Yeah, thank you. I want to quickly come here, Apostle. I want people to understand about PFM situation room. PFM situation room is not a, a apostle. Yeah. Hello. Yes. Uh, oh, you are. Are you uh, still there? Uh, Hello. So just give me just one minute to round up. Uh, let me let me round up to one minute okay. so that people can come in, sir. Okay, Very sorry yeah. for that. Uh, you know, I was cut off now. Yeah. Correct. Now, apostle, you see that this other collapse is saying the same thing. Nobody is saying the government is not working at all. Compare the money coming in. You find out. She will not to carry camera. Go, go to the SMA and find out how much is coming every, every month. 900 billion. Did you listen to this program last week? Did you hear yeah, what Umuru, yeah. the, the, the figures Umuru gave? Those are public information. You go and go find out. It's not on the road you, you carry camera. Go to Internal Revenue Board. Go and find out how much they are directing monthly. Compare with the work being done. The man is a failure. Let's claim the truth. We have three years to go. You are on this, you are on life, man. It's fighting parties, PDP members. Suspending of Yama, suspending the PDP chairman of, uh, of uh, what for? His own, uh, his own word. Suspending the lobby. Okay. Suspending. Okay. You know, you know, suspend those people. Comrade. Like, comrade. Like, yeah. Comrade. Comrade. Let me quickly. Comrade. Let me quickly. We have no other state, though. Would you tell him the truth? We have no other state. If this man will fail, all of us will suffer. If it's nothing, we will, we will gain it. But would you speak the truth? You are a man of God. Hmm. Thank you. Uh, let, me, let me leave this video for other people to call it. Okay. Uh, uh, thank you. Oh, God, they are bombarded. 100 missed call. Apostle Hiro, sir, what have you done in PFS situation room this morning uh, in America? Hello, hello. Uh, yes, hello, yes. Uh, where uh, caller your name and where are you calling from? Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm calling from Frankfurt, Germany. Okay, can you hold on for a minute? Uh, please hold on, stay on the okay. phone. I want people to understand this is PFS situation room, it's not. Question I would press him or he answer me. I pray no, we don't do that. The PFS situation. This is where you come, you discuss, you say whatever you want. No host by raw is authentic. Whatever how you feel, you say it's not my right. If you start asking a person, you know, oh, you are lying. You are no, that is not what PFS situation room discussion meant for. He can come and say whatever he wants. It is left for the people to ask him and talk. So it's not my job. I want you to, I want to clear that before people start saying, oh, he love Apostle, you know, sir. He just sit there. He allowed the, you know, sir, to be saying what is not true. That is not my job. You all can see, Umaro is nowhere to be found now. Umaro, Apostle, you know, sir, have blow the white chalk and Umaro have received the white chalk. So, <laughs> so, uh, so it's not my fault. Umaro told me we'll be here in 30 minutes. That the vehicle is running hot. How can the vehicle be running hot now? Because I pursue you, Rosa. I blow the white truck. The white truck is working. It's working. It's so uh, go ahead, caller. Okay. Okay. Uh, a few days ago, are you hearing me? Uh, 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 no, your network is bad, Apostle. I think you should not be watching the video there. Okay. Okay. Hold on. I was watching. I was watching beneath our window. The insecurity in that road is unbearable. There are people coming on that road. Okay, so hold on, sir. Hold, hold, hold on. Hold on. Excuse me, sir. Hold on for a second. Let me quickly, Apostle. Yeah. Uh, give me a second. I don't know what is going on here, but uh, okay. Is the network good? Better now? Is the volume good now? I can hear you very well, sir. Okay. Apostle, can you hear me very well? Yes, I'm hearing you. Okay, go ahead. Okay. I mean, uh, Apostle, you know, sir, just uh, compliment the, gov the governor that is doing very well. At the only area you see that is not performing well is the area of communication that he has to carry people along. He has to carry people along by communicating with them. It's not only that area, sir, Apostle. Please, I'm not accusing you because uh, you said you did not belong to any political party. You are just playing a neutral role in order for the government of the day to be okay for everyone. The only out road almost every week are full of Not only kidnapping, they think 
I was working the travel last time, three days ago for the internet in Frankfurt. Our Emma was explaining uh, how uh, one of his passengers was shot. I can see the bullet uh, injury for the vehicle, and they were helpless. Please, can you communicate this, this issue to the state government? I don't know if they are not seeing it. They to provide security. If it is every, uh, every uh, three, three kilometers, there should be a security for We need to out him. That road is a dead road. Please, that is just the area I want to contribute. Okay, God bless you. Uh, uh, I, I want you all to be patient. Uh, it's still shocking. Apostle, you know, sir. Uh, please. Hello, Apostle. Can you hear me? What did you yes, do to comrade uh, Bobo Maro? <laughs> it is <just> worse. <laughs> Yeah, so maybe that's okay. Yes, yes. Uh, Apostle did not do it. Let me answer for him. Apostle did not do anything. I just called him uh, coming tomorrow now. He's on his way. He will be in the studio in less, less than 20 minutes. <laughs> uh, with, uh, yes, I spoke with him like about an hour ago. He said in about 30 minutes. Uh, uh -huh. He so, will be in the studio in less than uh, 20 minutes. So uh, for that to be a fair, no, he fair did, debate. He did this for himself. Uh, he did it to himself. Apostle Uyinosa was ready to take the bull by the horn, and uh, he, he vowed yeah. that he's going to dismantle and destroy whatever that Apostle Uyinosa is coming to. Uh, uh, no, his is guy is overeating somewhere now. Exactly. The white truck, Apostle Uyinosa white truck is working. Let us call it. Let me look for the truck. Okay. Because we are doing this for, for the love of our state. Exactly. So let him come. But way. let compromise mm. Apostle, you know, sir. He chuck in there. Oh, I'm winner. Oh, I'm winner. Look at it. Look where he did the chuck. Look at it. Guy, am I all for it? Oh, what blow is a problem. Look at it. See, the chuck is working. <laughs> Why relative chuck Apostle? The apostle, apostle, the apostle, 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 I put the lion to sleep, apostle, I put the coyote to sleep. Yeah, great man. Uh, 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 Umaro is sleeping. Comrade Umaro is sleeping. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Uh, the show have not even started. Uh, go yes. ahead. Uh, Call her. Uh, I want to. I want to clear some. Uh, I want to uh, hold on, hold on so for a second. I just want to ask a question for. Go ahead. Yeah, just one minute. Uh, call uh, uh, they are all bombarded uh, everywhere. Apostle are blow everywhere. Go ahead. Apostle, I would just want to ask you about the don't lie. Me that the don't lie that we raise up with yeah. is dead and gone. The one in Asiburo Park was one of the best I don't lie in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. I don't lie, Kashata, I don't lie straight to Lagos Airport. To anywhere, to Kaduna, to Kano. I don't like was the best transport in Nigeria. It means it's dead and gone. Please, can you answer that question, Apostle? God bless you. Number one, have you go and check my broadcast? I have spoken about that several. As I've said before, I am not in government. I am not a politician. I'm only doing what God asked me to do. And uh, there are some questions what you need to know. Like, and uh, I, I believe in some of my broadcasts, I have said something of, of that to that nature that a governor should look into a door line, look into those okay, areas. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, uh, hold on, hold on caller. Apostle, you see, they are already start accusing me that I'm not being fair. What have I done wrong here that I'm not fair about? Umaro is coming. I called Umaro. I told him today is going to be dege dege. He told me we'll be here in 30 minutes. And his vehicle is running hot. Apostle have blown the white truck. Let's call the split the split. The white truck is working. That is for me to say. Look at it. Tell me what person have blown the white truck to that he has not affected. Eh? The white truck is working, my people. Look at the white truck. He is on the board now. <laughs> Don't blame me for it. <laughs> Go ahead. You cannot ask me such questions because I am not in government. I am not in government. So I am not in position to give you I am 
am not a politician. So I have no answer to give to you. It's, like it's like you're asking a lion where the, where the, uh, the, the chicken has slept. Hold on. <laughs> but the lion where the chicken has slept. So that question should not be directed to me because okay. I'm not the government. Please, I want everyone to go ahead and share this video. As you can see, we have not even started. This is the preamble of what is going to go down today. Apostle have blow the white chalk. Umaro is still on his way. And it's been one hour one late hour. now. So we are praying to God for Comrade Umaro to appear. Apostle is, is just, he have taken the, he have completely taken the show without even speaking the word. Only one thing that he said that Obaseki is working. So uh, those people are furious with that word. So go ahead, uh, caller. Where are you calling from? All right, I'm calling from New York. Okay, New York, go ahead. Yeah, so what I have to say to Apostle Uyinosa, like uh, my brother in UK said earlier on, mm. Obaseki has less than three years to go. Mm -hmm. Apostle, you, for, we call you Apostle. Okay, make I speak in one word of us going here. Mm. We call you Apostle, Apostle, I beg. Let that name, that office where God gives you, hey! respect that office. And don't just come on air to, because of one human being to lie to the world. After Obaseki, you see be apostle. I'm not sorry for me to say you lie. Sorry, I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I know, sorry for my language. Okay. But the issue is that Talk to must be the way you did talk about Obaseki, the trial. Yeah. We do not expect Obaseki to do really everything really for a two state in four let years. Me, because me. people don't call. He want to reply you. He want to reply you. He want to reply you. Let me reply okay. you, my brother. Obaseki is doing his best. I am not lying. I am not. I don't stand on the fence. I am not standing on the fence. Obaseki is doing his best. And whether we like it or not, he's doing his best. Uh, and we must Hello. come to the yeah, point. We have it. Uh, Apostle, the, we have multiple people on the phone. Multiple people. Yes. Go ahead, the last See, caller. Go ahead. Tell us where you are calling. When you call to accuse, no, when you call to accuse, then I totally disagree Hello. with you. So the government of the day oh, is God. doing it. Hold on. It's best to me uh, not be. I would like to protest myself. If somebody is talking, I will let the person to speak first, then I don't mind calling back. Okay. I don't want to be involved in argument. Okay, for some reason, uh, Apostle, we continue to get this, uh, this, uh, this volume problem here. Let me bring him back. Okay, it's better now. Okay, go ahead and I, I, I ask your question. Okay. Uh, I am Professor Samson Ezorba. And I want to thank uh, Mental Comrade for this good job that you are doing. This is some of the things that I think the Pope Freedom Movement was long overdue. And uh, thank you for making it happen now. Uh, welcome to our Thank you for coming to speak your mind. Uh, I'm, I'm going to speak like I'm sitting on the phone. Uh, I think you are allowed to speak your mind. As far as you said, you are representing whatever you say because God inspired you to do it. And you cannot be coerced to speak what is not in your mind. I think remain with your mind and what God has to do. I also want to tell uh, to ask for the question. I think your line, your line is breaking up. Can you can you cut it, uh, Kola? Kola, can you break your line and call back? There's something I want to say. Like when Apostle was talking, he said, "Your line is breaking up. Can you cut it and call back?" Okay, okay, okay. Uh, wow, we have not even have not even started anything. <sighs> Jesus, one hundred and forty-two minutes call. What the heck? Everybody wants to talk to Apostle Alfred. Uh, uh, hello, go ahead. So, like I was saying, is it better now? Yeah, loud and clear. Yes, I want us to understand that when we talk about governance and government, people must understand that we all, who are from Edu, we are qualified to be governor, senator, whatever position we should interest in. In, a, in our state. And we must also know that 
while we are campaigning, we also have the right to say whatever we think we can do. And if people decide to vote for you or they don't vote for you and you wait, what we must own those governments is that we got to wait because the man who went to contest have an idea of what he or she wants to do in the state. And we can only hold the person accountable to history, not to that that four years, because there's nothing you can do in that four years. You can't remove him. You can only impeach. If you cannot impeach, what are you going to do? You're going to wait at the end of four or eight years and say, hey, this governor, you disappointed, you do this. When we begin to run and create problems like we want him to tie all the old roads, that one is not possible in obviously, not to talk of Nigeria. How many contractors can he hire one to face all the road in Nigeria? Two, if we are talking like we gave him a list and we are check marking the list, uh, that's a different matter because yeah, I wasn't there. I didn't see any list that they don't raise for the governor during the campaign. It was the governor that was saying what you want to do. If those are the things we are asking to be accountable for, what the PFM Comrade uh, is doing is welcome because it's good for him to check the government and remind him these are the video of where you said you will tie this road, the road is not done. But if we are going to be imaginary, thinking we should do what we think in our house, I think some of us are not serious. So I will leave this back to both of you while I enjoy the discussion that uh, uh, Apostle, like I said, I yes, invite sir. you to speak your mind and be honest in whatever you said God has impressed you to do. Then there are people who ask your question based on what you think the people need. And be, like you said, it's not today, not about insulting people. It's about getting things done the right way. Thank you so much. Bye -bye. Okay. All right. Uh, God bless you. Uh, please, I want to appeal to everyone. I want to... We are still waiting on uh, Comrade uh, Bobo Mario to come on the show before we start the mail event. This is just preamble. Here we go. Another call again. Uh, they just keep calling. Uh, uh, Apostle Afredu, you know, sir, I want you to know that today's date is uh, Thursday, October 7, 2021, at about 12 p.m. here in Dallas, Texas, which is about 6 p.m. in Nigeria time. Is that correct, sir? Apostle, can you hear me? Yes, I'm hearing you. Okay. You understand that today's date is Thursday, October 7th. Is that is that right? Okay. So, you know Sorry. that when you come to PFN situation room, uh, whatever you say here, people are going to hold you accountable for it. You understand that? Sure. sure. Okay. Are you ready to put your, your integrity, dignity, and your repetition on the line for Governor Godwin Obaseki. I am here. <laughs> okay. So I'm I want you to understand here. whatever you say here, Mega Comrade is not going to correct you. I'm not going to call mm -hmm. any name. This is PFN situation rule. And those people are going to hold you responsible for whatever you say. Concerning the insecurity, you said the insecurity is good that Governor Obaseki is doing his best. Can you not tell us that at those states, security today is it better than when Comrade Adamali Oshomule was in power? Every administration has its own challenge. Every government has its own challenge. The challenge we experience in Oshomule regime is different from the challenge in Obaseke regime. The challenge in Gulag regime is also different from the challenge we are having in Buhari, in Buhari regime. So every administration has its own challenge. As Hello. A, as a, as a today, Hello. He might not be making noise. Hello. He might not be making noise, but he's doing his best. Go ahead. So every administration has its own challenge. Yeah, Omaru is joining you now. Now, 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 now. In less than five minutes. Okay, he's here already. So uh, he's here already. Okay, good, good. good. He's still driving. Apostle, Apostle, you know, sir, I put tomorrow on the, on the telly. On what an unfortunate situation. A, 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 can you just yes, pull sir. over? I will, sir. I will. Yeah. I will. I will. Eba, with you, sir. Uh, you are welcome to the to the show. Please, I want you to be safe. I want you to pull over if possible. 
play. I'm, I'm, I'm better, sir. I will move on. I'll move on. I'll okay. pack when I'm when the, I'm in a better place. Okay. All right. Please, yes, uh, everyone to seize their call for now. Uh, we are going to start the show. Unfortunately, you all know how this happened yesterday. Uh, <laughs> Apostle, you know, sir. What? What? Uh, what? what uh, well, uh, <laughs> I'm shocked. I don't know what to say anymore. Well, uh, Cobra tomorrow, what yes, a sir. disaster! What a disastrous day for <laughs> uh, a, a disastrous day for the haters of truth and a disastrous day for the worst governor in the history of Nigeria. A disastrous day for a technocrat, a man who had done himself as a technocrat, but in fact is an intellectually subservient human being. A man who, in all sense of governance, has failed the people of Edo State. A neo criminal, so to say, Governor Godwin Obasaki and his cohorts. Good afternoon, sir. Okay. Uh, let us start the show right now. Uh, this is Mega Comrie live from PFM Situation Room in Dallas, Texas, United States. Uh, we have our two brothers. Uh, I will introduce him as the last man standing on social media with Governor Godwin Obasaki. Uh, this is the explosive, unfitted PFN situation room royal barrel between Obaseki last man standing Apostle Alfred Odion, Uyenosa, and Edo State PDP mobilizing coordinator, Comrade Bob Umaro. Uh, God bless you. Uh, you are welcome Thank to you, PFN sir. situation room. Uh, Thank you, sir. you all have saw what happened for one hour now. Apostle Uyenosa have completely uh, exploded the whole Edo. Uh, those citizens that's for our mind and uh, the social media is on fire and i believe after we get off on air today a lot of people are going to be deliberating on uh, what uh, whoa, whoa, oh my god what an explosive apostle you know are true or this show today uh well uh you are welcome to the show coming tomorrow uh apostle you know sir, you, sir. before you came can you just go ahead and repeat what you said uh apostle Alfred, do you know sir Concerning uh, the insecurity. Yes. Before then, I want to quickly correct what uh, my brother Moro said about God, the government of Baseki. In as much you don't really align with what the government is doing, it does not really give us some some of the privilege to order some statement against the person of a man. And we must recognize that or we must appreciate that. You understand? Everybody has right. But there are some, some statements statement that shouldn't come out from our mouth. And if you call yourself a PDP mobilization, and you ought to know better, and it's not to come on and begin to call up as a keep such name, it's totally uncalled for. And this is me for you, and it's totally uncalled for. And if you are, excuse me, I have no apology for me. that, sir. Yeah, please, please, please. Thank you very much. Now, what I said. Like the insecurity in those states, Governor Bataki is doing his best. And he's doing his best, even in federal level. The insecurity everywhere, he's doing his best. And uh, you cannot expect him to cut off his head because you want to tell him wow. to get everybody. Even in our own area, even in my own area, I have to address security. So this insecurity issue is all over, it's all over the world. So Governor Bataki is doing his best, the whole best of knowledge. Because I move around the town. Number one, number one, I want to appreciate Apostle Alfred for coming online to take this uh, to take this disgrace for on behalf of Governor Godwin Obasaki. And uh, like I said, every word I have used against him, I am not sorry for it. If anybody is hurt that I have spoken against Governor Godwin Obasaki, the person can seek redress in court. You have already shot yourself on the leg and uh, pointed out to the house as a gay that Governor Godwin Obasaki is a failure. In a state, are you aware that the security vote of Edo State is 900 million? In a state where the security I'm, vote on, is 900 million. Hold no, on, allow, hold on. Allow in, a state, in, in a state where the security vote is 900 million, how can you, a citizen, be employing security guards to come and be providing that same security that is the number one responsibility of every sane and credible government for you? It shows that the government has failed. For you to have employed security on behalf of 
the man who is supposed to be protecting your life and property, then it goes to show that it's a total failure in terms of security. Now, if you say that uh, there is security, if you say that there is security in the doorstep and as such you cannot do anything, can you please take your car now and drive out to uh, Bini Expressway at this time? I want you to understand that whatever you are saying now, as far as security is concerned, uh, you are even angering a door citizen more. You are angering them more than what is expected of you to be telling them now that you are saying now that you are saying that uh, Edo State is secure if Edo State is secure how come that uh Bini Alchi Express World becomes a death trap for every uh, for everybody how come that citizens in Edo State cannot sleep how come that farmers and headers are having class how come that if senior PDB party chieftain was kidnapped in the eve of last month, how come that even the he head of service of Edo State was kidnapped during December and the government of Edo State paid over 50 million, uh, million naira ransom for his release? How come that Edo citizens are trooping to the streets asking for security of life and property for a governor that is receiving well over 900 million as security vote? If Edo State is secure, why are civil society protesting and asking the governor to spend money? If Edo State is secure. Why is my own brother from Esako Central, uh, Mr. Abuda, who came from the United States to felicitate with his family? Why was he killed? Are you aware that last month that the senior uh, leader in PDP was kidnapped? Same day in the morning, over 10 persons were kidnapped again. In July here, I escaped kidnapping. And you are telling the whole world that Edo State is safe. How is Edo safe? How is Edo safe? Edo is not safe. Edo is, Edo, Edo is a death trap to every Edo citizen. I am very, very sorry for the position uh, my brother is taking. I, I don't expect him with the toga of a pastor to come and stand on air and tell the people lies that the security issue of uh, Nigeria is because the federal government did this or that. Is it the federal government alone that is taking security votes? The federal government is giving the state security vote. Uh, Apostle, are you aware that the whole month, uh, year 2020, that 58.1 billion was the total allocation to Edo State? Yet the last of Edo State were murdered as if they were ordinary lands. Are you aware that many communities in Benin were fighting kidnappers, were fighting headsmen, and Governor Godwin Obataki tied his hand? He was busy taking private jet, traveling from state to state because he wanted the structure of party. See, it's the earlier you people begin to tell the governor the truth, the better it will be for all of us. Edo State is not safe. You are aware of it. And I challenge you, if Edo State is safe, why are the sons of Esa buying uh, vehicles and uh, giving support to vigilante groups within Esala? Why are Afema's sons and daughters doing the same thing? Why are Bini's sons and daughters doing the same thing? Why do we have vigilante all of a sudden taking over every street in Edo State? Is it not because of insecurity? I know that those that are watching now, they will be laughing at Governor Godwin Obaseke that you are coming to defend what is not defensible. You cannot defend this. It's as simple as that. Uh, mega comrades, my Edo people, my brothers and sisters in diaspora, if any man come to you and tell you that Edo State is safe and that the federal government should be blamed, let that man be a cause. Let the, the person and God stand to judge each other. Let God bring the judgment that is accrued to that person. And I want to say, anybody that say Edo State is safe, my family was kidnapped last year, a member of my family was kidnapped. I wish that person what is happening to Edo State now. I let the person tell me, amen. That is where I will stop. For insecurity, Edo State is a death trap, and Governor Godwin Obaseki, who had done himself as a technocrat, is a complete failure as far as security is concerned. Thank you. Okay, all right. Go, go ahead, uh, Apostle. He, he requested him. He requested him. Me, Hold on. Go let ahead. Let go back to tomorrow. Let me take it off from there. As tomorrow asked President Bubu how much is collected for security votes and why is his security state prevalent in Nigeria. Tomorrow, have you been a is President Shibuari is collecting a security vote? Why is there still killing all over the country? Hold on, hold on, hold on. We need to talk. We need to be very sensitive. Now you are talking about insecurity vote being collected by all of us. That is being collected by all is all over the, the country, and you are not talking about that. Now we're talking about insecurity. Insecurity did not start today. I'm in the door. I sleep with my two eyes closed. Before hey. Obaseki came, before Obaseki came to existing, there have been insecurity. 
People have been employing their own security. People get their own private uh, security. The truth is this. We must tell ourselves the truth. Not even a part of truth. Now, when you come at yourself as a I totally disagree with you. Now, before you come as a senior, you should also point the same finger to Bwari to say, Bwari is also a senior. Why? Because when we want to act, the fact that you hate a man, that not that we must tell ourselves the truth. Whether we or not, for me, I'm in the stage. Things are going where the way it should be. Now, what? there might be issues in my own area, there might not be insecurity in my own area. That doesn't mean there is insecurity in my own area. Now, in New Covenant, I don't know if every citizen has his own role to play. Now, you talk about the Asian, you talk about the Asian, it's a corporate social responsibility. Even in America, the citizens join hands with the government to build their system, whether we like it or not. The fact that you have hatred for a man, that doesn't need to be condemned. I will not accept that. Now, the truth is this. I am not defending Governor Obaseki, but we must stand on the path of truth. Let's say the way that the issue there was insecurity. Now, my brother, you see, 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 the truth is now. The truth is this: we must tell ourselves the truth. A lot of persons still sleep with their eyes closed, and we should stop giving our people in diaspora wrong information. There are a lot of people in Bini they sleep with their eyes closed, with their two eyes closed, whether we like it or not. We don't need to paint it because I want to get a. a I want to get <laughs> People are very security for themselves. Whether you like or not, we are not truthful to themselves. People hire security. Don't you have get man? Don't you have get man? People have get man. People have get man. So the truth okay. is, so, I don't know. So we should be careful just because you can have I, a man. I, you okay. Say, oh, can I come in? Man. Uh, 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 I, uh, I want to drop something. I want, okay. please, I understand. <clears throat> please, just one minute. Apostle right, Hiro, sir. Do you? I want. I can't save you here. Uh, this is PFS situation room. Are you aware that you are putting your credibility on the line? You said people in Edo State are sleeping with their with their eye closed. That the are insecurity. So I tell you, my area, we sleep my, with two, two eyes closed, and there are I, so many areas people sleep with their two eyes closed. I Even in Nigeria, you know, all over the world. Even apostle, America, my son, Apostle, you are a son to me. I will not want you to come to PFS situation rule and destroy and torpedo your life for Obaseki. What you are saying now, are you sure of that? Yes. People okay. sleep with their two Okay, go ahead, uh, Comrade Romaro. Thank you, sir. Uh, apostle, I appreciate your... I appreciate your resilience. I don't, sincerely, I don't envy your position. Trying to defend a man that uh, in all sense of governance has lost it is a very, very huge task. And I promise you, uh, you know, there are some exams you write. Before writing the exam, you know you have already failed. This outing is a failed attempt already to clean up what is already dirty. I want to take you back. A mega comrade, I know a lot of persons are watching us, and I want them to confirm whatever I'm saying. If yeah, I'm we saying have about a thousand people watching you now, one thousand. Good. I do, I do people, I want you people to understand that the problem of insecurity in Edo State started immediately after 2020 election. And ask me why. You see, Apostle Fred wants me to open the can of worm that has been hidden for a very long time, and I'm going to Try. open it. If Edo, State, if Edo State Governor Adams handed over a safe Edo State to everybody, don't forget, he came up with, um, there was this body he came up with, uh, uh, something coalition, I've forgotten. It was different guys, uh, uh, vigilante, different groups, and all the rest of it, to provide security for Edo people. Governor Godwin of Basaki inherited that, but he did not sustain it. So it was sustaining the state for four years via the Nigerian police network. And it was strictly a federal initiative that they came up with different programs and different uh, commission of police that came in, came up with their program to arrest insecurity in the state. That, that alone did a good job. I don't know if you are hearing me clearly, sir. 
Uh, we are hearing you, but it's breaking. Good. I the, the noise is from Apostle Yunus aside. Okay, okay. So, shortly after that, the 2020 election, comrade, why I said the 2020 election brought about the insecurity in a dose state. I mean it. Oh, of okay. anybody being kidnapped. kidnapped. Uh, we have the 2020 <laughs> We're having a network having difficulty. A uh, but go ahead. Can, you, can hear you now. Okay. During the 2020 During the, election, I say I that say, the issue of kidnapping of uh wow. Unfortunately, is driving and uh and the around the street and shoot people was not prevalent. <laughs> that issue was not prevalent in a those state of normal street shooting and all the rest. We started having those street shootings, have started having hiding kidnapping among others shortly after the Edo State election. Please, Apostle Uyirosa, are you aware that during the Edo State 2020 election that boys were mobilized? That it is the fallout of a between the APC and the PDP, especially most of the boys who are loyal to the governor, Governor Obaseke, who decamp with the deputy governor, that that is the reason a dose state is under tension today. <laughs> are you also wow. aware that most, <laughs> yes, that most of the boys that have been caught in kidnapping, they are not just Fulani alone. Many of our boys at home, we are caught alongside with them. Now you will ask me, where did these guys get these weapons Maybe. that they are using? Where Maybe. did you get them? And who has the, has the governor mobilized the security apparatus of the state as headed by the commissioner of police and uh, the DSS and the uh, zone, uh, zone 5, uh, uh, is this zone 5 now? Zone 5 uh, officer that they should come the length and breadth of those state for this? No. Are you also aware that it's under the reign of Governor Godwin Obaseki that boys troop to Bini Street, daylight, and we're shooting and they did that for free and nothing happened? Now you are telling me that security issue is federal government alone. Yes, I agree that there are security challenges in every state in Nigeria. I also want to put you on notice and put every adult citizen on notice that irrespective of these security challenges, governors have risen up to take challenge. Look at what happened earlier this year. When uh, 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 River State, uh, Patakot, was invaded by boys, what did Governor Wicke do? Governor Wicke rose up immediately and within six hours, that tension was quite down. Go and check every other prevailing state. The issue of kidnapping or banditing of uh, Boko Haram, we know it has political undertone. And it will take political inter intervention, a sincere political intervention to solve them. But as far as this issue of uh, uh, kidnapping and insecurity is concerned in those states, I think security forces should question the governor, the deputy governor, and some major stakeholders on why such a thing is going on or why the governor has not mobilized the police and tell them to come the length of breath and bring these boys to book. People kill people freely in a state and go scot free. And they were telling me there's no insecurity. Okay, fine. If Buari is to take, if Buari is distributing or releasing allocation up to, up to uh, security vote to everybody, and the governor is taking 900 million. Opposed to who you know, sir, what has governor Godwin or Basaki done with 9 million? Because uh, 900 million, because by our calculation, every year the governor is having 10.8 billion on security. Does a uh, those state, the state you are in, does it look like a state where 10 billion naira is being spent on security? Does it even look like a state where a governor has sincerely spent 50 million on security? Let's tell ourselves the truth. You see, uh, you people will only anger me more because there are certain ways that if I throw out to the public, a those state will be born. And I don't want that those with to burn. I don't want the citizen to troop out and stone the demon that we call the governor, a man who deceived the people to get to the, the second term under the platform of my own party. I don't want to go far. There are information that if I release, and those citizens will chase governor, governor of Basaki with stones and fire out of those things. And if you people push me, if the issue of insecurity is not addressed, if the governor does not take his hands and his uh, body back to the table and start kicking off a door state, I will tell you the truth. I will mobilize the door people with information that is needed. And in their anger, they will do what is unprecedented in the history of Edo state politics. As far as security vote is concerned, Governor Goblin or Bateki, Philip Saibu, uh, Osarodio again, 
and uh, your heart. Where is our money? What are you people doing with the money? Why are people still being kidnapped in the dose? Why are people dying? Why are small, small boys, our children who are supposed to be in school, our younger ones who are supposed to be in school, why are they taking up arms, moving from street to street? And then at the end of the day, the gov deputy governor holds meeting with a group of boys who insist and call them to be dangerous and settles them financially. These are not just mere allegations. These are things that are true and factual. So I am challenging you again, sir. Mm. Uh, you put apostles there. Apostles simplify that you are a man of God. And if you believe in the Bible and you actually believe in Jesus Christ, I want you to know that the people you are defending, that you are defending against the people, are first having responsibility to defend the lives and property of the people, and they have faith. And you that is a man of God, are supposed to stand and tell them the truth. You are not supporting these people against these people. Don't forget, it took God the adequate time and energy to create these people and governor Bataki in his lazity is allowing little things to destroy the lives and property that god has given to mankind it is unfair and i want us to probe into 900 million are you also aware that security vote is 900 million i rest my case for you to speak sir okay uh, thank right. you comrade but mario comrade. thank you uh, hold on hold on for a second Bob, hold on apostle Apostle, I know you're gonna. Uh, we are concerned here. I want you to be aware. We have thousands of people watching this show right now. Uh, we have uh, 1,000 plus watching. Apostle, I feel you know, sir. I love you so much. Uh, I want to repeat my, my word again. Are you ready to put your credibility on the line for this matter, or we can move on to another topic? Apostle, uh, and then we watch you receiving a phone call. We don't want cheating in PFN situation room, and people are committing here that other sticky people are calling you, telling you what to say. Uh, why are you on phone call during the uh, Umaro's uh, uh, replies? You should, you should know I'm a media man. I'm also a businessman. People can always call me. You understand? Now, I want to challenge tomorrow again, or whatever you get. How many times as an opposition, you come out to challenge presidency people as an opposition? No, we are, we are talking of a do state. We are talking no, of a do state. No, no, no. I know no. what I'm talking about. I know what I'm talking about. No, now, forget what, about Mohamed Buhari. We are talking of a do state. What do you do now? There's a noise over there. Uh, coverage, coverage. Uh, not coming out to begin to cast and get a man. So that I will not take from you. Allow the man to finish his turn off and stop instigating the people against the government. And what you are trying to do now, you are trying to release an arrest into the state, which is totally unacceptable. So for, for crying out loud, let us shoot me. Let, no, uh, let me cut you there. Let me cut you there, Apostle. No, 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 no. No, take that back. No, no. No, hold on, hold on, Apostle. Apostle, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, Apostle, hold on. No, this is PFS situation where everybody is free to see their mind. It's time to whip up sentiment. You see, uh, when people do no. not have what to tell the governor, but man, tell him to watch me. Governor, Governor Basaki cannot do me anything. He is my servant. I voted for him. I went to 192 states with him. If he's doing anything that is wrong, uh, I have the right to call him to order. Uh, Apostle is just trying to whip up sentiment. He wants the people to pity him and pity the governor. Sorry, it is too late to cry when the head is off. Is it me? I'm whipping sentiment. Is it, is it what I am saying that I stopped him from trying roads? Yesterday, we discussed about Awa. Did our people not come on air to say that they are being shortchanged out of government? Okay. Am I the one that is telling him to post work that he's doing? Am I the one that also tell him that he should sack the Edose consultant on health? Are you aware that because we brought out health issue that the consultant has been sacked? I am coming. I'm going to feed those citizens with information. Credible information. Don't worry about it. Any sentiment you people want to whisk with, I, 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 don't, I don't care. But what we have said is that Governor yes. Godwin of Basaki is a fraud. No, comrade. 
Let me. I, I, I want to. I want to hold on. You are calling. Hold on. You already spoke for seven minutes. Allow people to talk. No. Hold on. Uh, no, can I make one thing clear? Let me talk to. Let me talk to my brother. No, I want to brother. hold on. Hold on, Apostle. We are talking of a do state right now. I don't appreciate you injecting the federal into a do state uh, internal affair. I, I believe and I will advise you to desist from that. Let's focus on the do. Charity begins at home. Go ahead. Exactly. Uh, Omaro, mute, mute your mic, please. Mute your own. Hold on. Go ahead. That this uh, that by November, that like, yes, it will be one year in office. You cannot judge a man. No, like no, that. no, 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 you are misleading I'm people. Kidding. No, stop it. No, stop no, 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 it. will be I'm five kidding. years, not one year. Stop me misleading I am people. Coming now. Okay. I am coming. I am coming. I know what I'm talking about. I know what I am talking about. I'm a man, I don't stand on a fence, and I also hate when people want to blow things out of proportion. I hate when people blow things out of proportion. Whatever we do, whatever we say, is not going to bring sanity to the state. All we need to do right now is to see how we can join together to make the state great. Not coming on and begin to say some things that will begin to cause anarchy in the state. Because everybody's mind is quite different. So everybody's mind is different. So we should be careful what we release, what we say. The fact that you don't like the man, we need to be very, very careful. We need to be very, very careful. We are trying to see how we can make the state great. Bring it to say this, this is the insecurity issue to me by the grace of God. Obaseki is doing his best. Then the people, all we need to do is to cooperate with Hello. the governor to make the state great. To make the state great. Uh, go and ahead, and talk. Go ahead. Where are you calling from? I begin to tell everybody. So I will not uh, subscribe to what I say, trying to okay. instigate uh, hold the on. Okay. Let, the let's take a discord. Go ahead. Go ahead. You are calling from Spain. Go ahead. Okay. You see that? Uh go go ahead. Go ahead, Apostle. You know, sir. So, I want to I want to release this number out. Hold on, let me bring this number my, out. Uh, please, I want you all to call this number. There's no insult here. The number is plus three four seven two two five three two four two one. I repeat, plus three four seven two two five three two four two one. Uh, wherever this person is, an evil and his enemy of a do. If you all know him, you people should bring him to order. His phone number is uh, three plus three four seven two two five three two four two one. Uh, go ahead, Apostle. What I'm saying, what I'm saying, what my brother Umoro is doing right now is totally uncalled for. The fact that you had misunderstanding yeah. with the yeah. government. Go ahead. The fact that you had misunderstanding. Okay. That doesn't mean. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. So see how you can uh, destroy the administration. There is news over there. Go ahead. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Anonigo. May God bless you. And I thank uh, the other of my brother, Umuru, no? Mm -hmm. uh, my message to our brother, Pastor Uji you know, sir. Please, if you are really a pastor, you have to speak the truth. When truth is coming out from a man, we know. You are speaking to we, we are in Western world. If we are speaking about our own state, don't bring federal, federal history. Then I heard when you said that. Okay, hold on, hold on. They are cutting you off. Hold on. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I think they are cutting you off. Uh, uh, comrade. Hello? Comrade. Wait, this guy is Hello? calling Uyin a criminal. Oh, in the criminal. Don't Hello? call. Listen, let me address this. Hold on. The number I released, he called. He tried to insult uh, Apostle Afre Uyinosa, which I am not going to, I am not going to take. And uh, he's writing me a message saying, will you, will you know the criminal? Well, this individual, I want everyone to unleash insult on him privately. 
God bless you. Go ahead. So, uh, Pastor Ujino, sir, please, we all have a family, family in Edo. We have friends. We have everybody over there. So, please, don't come on here and deceive us. No. Thank God there is social media. There is everything. For you to come out and tell us that there is security. I watched one of your videos when you were driving daytime. You said that Aunshi Road uh, is good. People can travel. Pastor, you know, sir, we want you to take up your car. We want you to drive Aunshi Road as from 6 o'clock in the evening. Then the other way, please, where is the street light in those states? Where is the street light in those states? When God created the world, the first thing he said, let there be light. Where is the street light in those states? We are not even talking in the houses now. The, in the street light, there is no street light in the state. But it's, as from 7 o'clock, everywhere is dark up. People have started running at home. So please, I'm begging you, eh, if you want to really help us there, though, the other of your opponent right now is not a bad person. He's only saying, that, uh, he's only trying to talk, to talk to the state governor to do the normal things. So you are not taking this thing now, Pastor. You know, so I'm looking at you, eh? You are not taking this thing to be any other thing. Please, don't take this thing to be an offense or this one is insulting or bad thing or, or no. It's, it's just... All right. Let me... Uh, I want to clear this. Right. Apostle, you know, sir, hold on. I want you to record your statement. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, Apostle, you know, sir, when people are, when people call you, try to insult you, I don't, I don't let them do it. When they try to, you try to plug the governor against uh, Umaro, it's unacceptable. And I do not want it's you to go, I do not want you to go to it's that good. route. Uh, because if you come here telling the uh, do people what is not true, it's also, you are also energizing them to be to be insulting the government if anybody can say that because they already know it's not true and people are saying the government is paying you and i know the government is not paying you anything i I'm, i know that okay so now you it's trying it's to so this is what a terrorist a emitter was doing i do not want you to go to that route uh try telling him that he's trying to uh, 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 excite unrest in the state no both of you are doing the same thing you are trying to uh, 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 start unrest from the citizen by telling them what is not true. We all know insecurity in Edo is bad. There's no security. So I want you to treat him the way he will treat you as a brother. Please, don't, I'm begging yes. you. I don't know how to. Let me, let me go back to what I'm saying. Uh -huh. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm very objective. I don't stand on the fence. When people are trying to instigate, I know, I know. The truth is this, whatever Umoro is doing right now, to me, is totally unacceptable by causing chaos in the state. And this is the truth. Okay, and I keep what is the chaos is causing in the state? What is the chaos? Now, like, wait, wait, listen, listen, when you have a governor, when you have a governor, no matter what you try to do, this is what they call roundtable talk, this is what they call understanding. Mm -hmm. If you have issue with what Moro is doing right now, I can tell you it's because they had a personal issue with the governor. And to me, no, what it's wrong. Maro, hold on, hold on. What is the, I ask you a direct question. This is a situation where we discuss. What is the please, please, hold on. Stay on the line, eh? Yeah, hold on. Hold on. Hold on, please. Uh, I ask you a question, uh, Apostle. What is the unrest? What is the chaos is creating in the state? Hello. Go ahead. To my own best of knowledge, to my own best of knowledge, the what they call understanding. I just the, I need the I need the direct answer. What where is the unrest and where is the chaos? I'm asking you a direct the question. Statement, the statement coming out from the mouth of Umaro can cause. Does Umaro not have a freedom of speech? Does he not have right to speak now, whatever I want? No, everybody has speech and uh, freedom of speech, and Umaro cannot tell me. Is a, a PDP mobilizer just because you are prone to some certain information? And well, you have that is not the question I ask you. I, I yeah. to, you are you are deviating. Yeah. This question yeah. I ask you, you you just made an allegation against him that is trying to create a unrest in the state. Where is the yes. unrest is creating? Where by all his utterances, all, all his utterances, are you also not with the governor? It's not, no, to my own, I would take that, no. I would, why would you be insulting okay. the governor? 
All right, all right. Let's uh, let's take call. Umaro, it's okay. Let's go ahead and answer the call. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Go ahead. Yes. Please, whenever you call, be prepared to speak. I have a limited time. In about thirty minutes, okay. it will be over. So go ahead, uh, Umaro. Uh, thank you, sir. Um, I was to you know, sir. If you have known me very well, I'm a man of peace. But when I speak, sometimes they are for war, especially in the desperate situation like that of which a do state is facing. I cannot, for the sake of, I want to please Governor Godwin or Basaki, or because uh, I'm looking for appointments that uh, may never come from him, I will not stand on the fence of history that I am not supporting the government, I'm not supporting the people. I went around 192 words with the governor of Edo State, which I want to categorically state that Apostle Inosa may fail in even attending 90 of 192. So you should know the heinous task and the sacrifice I have paid. Most of this community, all of them, all the words, I got there before the Maro, governor. God bless you. And I let, me, let me stop you, Maro. Uh, no, I wanted, I wanted to hold, give him a point. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Please hold on, caller. Hold on. How can you be calling? Music is playing. Apostle, you know, sir. Uh, we do not appreciate you receiving call. People telling you what to tell him. We do not like it. Listen, what you what you be doing is completely out of out of professional way to talk to people. Hold on, hold on, Apostle. Hold on. What can I want you show now? Huh? Hold on. Apostle, what you be demonstrating here is very, very bad. Very disrespectful to 1,134 people watching you right now. Very, very bad. You don't see me answering my phone on my ear. You don't see Umaro doing that. You constantly continue to do it. And I believe people told you to use that word. In order, to, in order for you to try to intimidate him, watch your banner, wake up with you, see. Okay, say what you want to say. Thank you, Thank you. No, call it. Call it. Go ahead. Okay. Hello, morning. Go ahead. Your name and where are you Hello, calling from? Where are you calling from? Your name. I'm calling from Canada. My okay. name is Okay, go ahead. I would like to. Uh, uh, in such a case, we would like to encourage the people to get the door people against the governor. Exactly. What Apostle Lugino you know, sir is saying is the correct thing. Exactly. If you want to have differences with the governor, if you go and settle it, just um, the, um, that is um, instigating the door people against the governor. How how is he hold on hold on caller caller hold on hold on caller how is he instigating the people against governor because the same word I've been used against you for more than five years how I understand you, my brother. These are the same. Can you can you mute your your own Maro? Mute your own. This is the same word, the same system of intimidation, the same English that they have used on me for four years until about two three months ago. They now saw that everything that I said have come to light. Now, Edo people now they don't know what to tell me. Because every prophecy I have prophesied against governor. Right now, me, I'm not here to criticize Governor Obaseki. I will not do it. What am I going to say that I've not said before? I want Obaseki to pepper them. That is the fact. Bola de pepper them. That is what I want. So for what you. What we need right now is for everybody to put hands together back. It's too late to war. cry. It's too late when to the cry. Head what is off. What we are doing it's here is try to see if Obaseki can have sympathy on you people. You people have nothing to do, Governor, but you because uh, you... Uh, hello, sir. Yeah, we, go ahead. We, 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 will, we will not throw away from the fact that the structure of Nigeria... The structure we are not talking of Nigeria. We are talking of a state. Mega comrade. Uh, 
Mega comrade. Okay, all right. Uh, no, no, no. State please. have autonomy. State have autonomy, sir. You are wrong. Yes, I know, but the state does not control security. They control it, yes. Yes, yes. You wrong. You wrong, sir. You wrong. Hold on. Let me let me tell you. Something. The state of Texas here. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. Mega comrade, sir. Mega yeah. comrade. Uh, you see, when you go to a battle and you have a sophisticated uh, soldier who is who is a, who is a, who is a champion in battles and then you have an army of one million people and they know that this soldier they cannot take him down they begin to use all uh, schemes to see if they can weaken the soldier whatever they are saying here is just hearsay i am not inciting the people and i take no apology whatever the governor want to do against they me can't speaking do you for nothing, the people nothing they're going to do because you, you are not doing anything wrong I am not sorry for any word I have used, and I want to state it again. My journey is far. For the respect I have for adult people, I have to pull uh, by the road. And for the respect I have for you, I cannot turn down your call to answer the call of adult people. And that is why I'm here. And I want Thank to you. say it again, any day, any time. God in heaven is my witness. I have no personal fight against Governor Godwin Obaseki. Before the election, I met him a couple of times. I'm going to send a particular video to you. The item lion and tiger, when Kabaka said uh, to uh, Pastor Ize Yamu that these are the lions and tiger that will produce a prosecute election, we were the team who came up with item lion and tiger to tell them that we are brothers in Edo State that we don't have lions and tiger to release. Why did the people not say I was inciting Edo people against Tony Kabaka? I have called many times, I've led protests against Governor Adams of Somali. Why did Governor Adams people and everybody did not say that I was instigating people against Governor Adams? You are aware, sir, that I have said a lot of things against President Muhammadu Buhari, both written and on videos. Why has the people in the federal government not said I'm instigating people against the federal government? You see, these are tactics to run away from the fact. Before I go, sir, I want to say this. Apostle you know, sir, is in a dull state. This is the time for you to advise the governor to be true. The governor, government of Basaki administration will be five months, uh, say, uh, five years in uh, by next month on the 12th of next year. I want to tell you that, that, uh, that admi this administration is a complete fraud. Apostle you know, sir, how many years, how many years will it take the governor to bring Gele, Gele to life? Gele, Gele is on MOU. Is it me that is still telling the governor that he should not do industrial park? Is it me that I've made the governor not to provide, uh, not to build the airport in a donut? Is it me that I've asked him not to be able to give account of security votes and 58.1 billion that I spent in uh, in 2020? All this, all this running away from fact. Am I also the one who have instigated the people to go and ask questions why Governor Godwin Obaseki sold the Doe Library? Is it me? Is it me that has also asked Governor Godwin Obaseki or instigated those people? To go online and begin to question the health sector that has made that has made the governor to, to sack that has made the governor to sack the consultant to address the government on medical matters. Is it me that I have done all that? Let us be frank to ourselves. Here we have a governor that is not a good manager of our resources, and here we have a pastor defending a man who is who, in all sense of the law, is incompetent, has failed, and should be charged for corruption. Here is a pastor defending him. That that, 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 that that is one on the other side. Here is a governor that from January to date has been receiving a location and, and the security vote and our people have been slaughtered like cow. And you are saying... Oh, the network is bad. Go ahead. The... Okay, sir. Good evening, sir. I don't have... Are they not having families in a do state? Am okay. I also not an adult citizen with a family okay. whose yeah. life is on the verge of being safe or not safe? Am I also not a citizen who is asking the resources to better the life of our people? It is not about me. God in heaven is my witness that I have no personal issue with him. My issue with him is the complete and colossal failure and the mm. pains on third hardship that it is also unpaidful that God, God, Governor Godwin of Basaki is an accidental history in the in the annals of a do state it's going to in the chronicles of a do state when a do citizen remember uh, governor uh, godwin or basaki they will cry there will be no day like that before it or after it that a do people will regret ever voting for governor than this and you are time show, show that we are some in. love tomorrow please can everybody 
show some love to Maro and uh, Apostle Yuno. So if you don't know how to press anything, just hit the like and love. If you are you to go ahead and hit the like button, it's not easy. He's driving, his network is frustrating him. You can see it from work right now. He's a hard working man, not waiting for government money. Please, I mean, show some love to this young man. This rising star, a man that has said the way he Go ahead and show him some love. Uh, go ahead, so, Okuta, go ahead. Can we answer so, one phone call, please? Okay, sir. Hello? Yeah, go ahead. What are you? Go ahead. Uh, I also want to thank our brother Apostle Ushita and uh, also our brother Bob Kumar. God bless everyone of us. Okay. This question is direct to Apostle Ushita. See, uh, my brother, I love you for mother. I never hate you. Forget the father that watches you now. You already try to defend yourself and defend for your mother. Nobody is for mother. Everybody love our city. Everybody love our city. There are some questions. There are some words that Bobo Man will throw out. Then you will try not to, you know, as it to extend that word to federal. Which Baba Kata Kata Kata, you know, correct you over it. He now asks you a question that you're supposed to give a specific answer to it. You put it. You will dream when yourself. You will tell yourself. See, my chairman. You see, this is era you you can be able to put your name in the history. Forget the fact of what is happening today. Everybody knows that God is over that he has failed. Everybody knows the bad out. Don't be here to side over. He is not Bobu Maru is not here to fight over Turkey. Nobody is here he to fight. He's only him. here to speak what he has saw mm -hmm. because he's there on the ground. Correct. He is also saying that he is not any way to apologize over what he's saying. That he's saying the fact. This is war. Why are you trying to dribble us? That we cannot come back to our state anymore. You say that those states is safe. Everybody can see. Should I shock you? About four or five days ago, this one is very close to my family. Yes, she was kidnapped. A lady was kidnapped. A family sister for me. You say I don't get to see. Clearly, in every year, you say I don't get to see. Where? You see, why are you doing all these things? Don't attach yourself to what you know. Those people we know that they are, you know, they are constituting users in the do state. Don't do that. You have maintained your name. You have maintained your reputation. Continue the work of God. Any political or politicians or issues did not fit you. My brother, leave it and continue the way of God so that you will not damage your name in future. Thank you very much. And okay, thank uh, you for our that. chairman Kataka, the God bless you. Thank you. For all this, you know. Thank you very much. Good thank, night. You. thank you. Night. Thank you. Thank uh, you. That was a call from Jenny. All right. It's all right. Uh, Apostle, you can see from phone call to studying of text messaging. People are watching. Well, people are not stupid. I will advise you. I, I understand. I say, son, I love you so much. Why can't you just give them an hour or two hours? I, I understand. I understand. Uh, hold on. This, what we are trying to do is. Oh, under, I understand. If you go back this. after this show today, I, hold on. After this, we have a thousand two hundred plus watching you. When you go back today and watch this video, you will see that whenever someone else is talking, you are not paying attention. But when you are talking, everybody pay attention. So if you are a teacher, or if you are a student in the classroom, I will escort you out of my class. But unfortunately, I will not do that because this is situation room where we discuss, not where we receive phone call. Not where we start looking at text message. Where we discuss, please, my brother. Let's move forward. We have a limited time. Uh, go ahead. All right. Ah, uh, I am going through the chat on our broadcast. We're online, so I hear with my ear, and I'm following what is happening. Now, the truth is this: the truth is this. This is not the time for us to begin to fight 
Let's answer this call. Let, let's, whenever I call calling, we're going to answer. Can I call Please. in again? Or is it coming by the program? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, whenever I call coming, we are going to break whatever we are saying. We answer the call. Go ahead. Okay. Mm. Uh, uh, Mr. Moro, thank you once more for coming on board. Uh, Pastor, uh, hold on. Uh, I want us to understand something. I said it while you were not there, and I'm repeating it again. I said that to be a governor or to be anything that do see, every do like is qualified. There's something we cannot do. That is, somebody went to contest and told the people what they want to execute. And we have note of those things. We can remind him like the way you are reminding him. I don't have a problem with that. But for us to expect perfection, that would be after the tenor to say he was a bad governor. Then he didn't do this, he didn't do this, because he trumped and he failed. No, no, I, 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 objection, to I, 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 objection to that. Objection to that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I understand. Let me quickly address that. I, I, I want, uh, hold on. I will forget. Uh, I understand. Don't make uh, the apostle look like he doesn't know why he accepted to come there. Because the apostle said in the beginning, you ask him. You ask him. He said, he, he, he said you ask him, are you sure you are willing to take this bullet? Yeah, I'm he feeling said, yes. for him. I'm you feeling for him. him. Yeah. How did he come to become what he is? He told you God inspired him. I think you ask him enough. Whatever happened to him, I think he can change the man. Okay. So All right. All right, all right, hold on. Don't leave yet. Don't leave yet. I you you are calling from Massachusetts, Boston. Right? Okay. Okay. Yes, you, you you are aware that President Joe Biden just came into power, not even up to one year, right? Yes. yes. Is American people blaming him already? Yes, we are fighting. Okay, then we are fighting people are fighting Joe Biden already. Less than yes. one year. Why are you not saying that they should allow Governor Baseki to finish his eight years before they, no, they no. I mean come no, I'm not saying they should allow him to finish it. Okay, yes. correct yourself. I and I said I praise you more mm -hmm. for reminding him his electionary uh, promises. Mm -hmm. But what, uh, what everybody is against is that don't call him a thief because he has not finished his tenure. You don't know whether no, we already there. You him. already people are calling him Dubai thief, he's not thief already less than one year, and you yeah, are enjoying democracy in America. No, I'm you. The reason why I'm telling you, okay, let's use uh, let's use Governor Wiki. No, use your state governor in Texas to tell us what is going on. Okay, right now, Governor Abe, Governor Abe is securing the border. He took the border control. It's not a federal, it's a state. Because he saw the way migration are coming to Texas, he only tells the Department of Public Safety on the border. He has taken it upon himself to secure the Texans. That is what but Governor Basek is not doing. Governor Basek has failed in that. And uh, no, Governor you, Abe you is so doing it in Texas. No, Baba, tell it. Do you agree that people in Texas are against the government for him? Is the the people, people, let me, I live, let, 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 now you, you call me to Texas. Let me educate you about Texas. I've been here for 20 yeah. something years. In here in Texas. Okay. Governor Abe, right now, is the, is the Republican. I am a Democrat independent. Governor okay. Abe right now is fighting the insecurity of illegal migration. Correct. Okay. Obaseki is not doing it. Fuller and Hesmer from Guinea Conakry, Guinea Bissau are running wide in Ogbelaka. In New Benin, they are even eating from you in Ogbelaka. Go okay. to Benin today, go to uh, Cesavio. Uh, it's all Fuller and Hesmer. Governor okay. Obaseki is doing absolutely zero. Don't okay, even let, don't go there. Let me let me share with us, Papa. Let me share with you the true life story now on television about this story. True life story. It's personal to me. There is a boy that I train. His name is Demo. Yeah, he's mm -hmm. the first officer. Mm -hmm. He traveled to Isha for a job with somebody. It was late, and they told him to sleep because his brothers will hear this message. They told him to sleep. God this Christian on the road that tomorrow they travel. He insists he wants to go to Benin. And the vehicle they wanted to enter, for whatever reason, was looking for prestigious ones in this city. And they were uh, kidnapped, kidnapped them. Now, for whatever reason, they are not in difficulty. They started calling for their relatives. The other man who hired him is people able to pay 500,000 to refuse to release him. Himself, he's not supposed to be a bargain for one city. And the kidnapper said, he wants to be fair enough. He said, he needs to bury the man and kill the man. Two things is involved. He's my boy. Why did he 
Rest in peace. Two, having that net that is easy to inconvenience everybody, and meeting this water low, and the country is not able to raise more than 150, is it going to from heaven blame these people? You see, there are things we do on our own, which you just I try to explain, that does not help this security. The second one I want to tell us as a new people, myself and some people here in America, we are contributing to a those security network. We have so many things we wanted to do for them. But when we see that they, their complaint was not less, we didn't do, do anything to get from this, make us understand that they were getting the support they want from government. No, 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 like no. No object they are not getting support from the government. My community are not getting anything. And since then we don't even hold meetings on the security of the day because it still went less. But you will not accept because people want profession. Where is profession security anywhere? Is it in America here? Is it possible? Of course. Thank you. Uh, okay, God bless you. Uh we we appreciate his call and uh Apostle, you know, so I want to say this. I applaud your courage. Uh you heard what he said that I should allow you to say whatever you want because I as a person who have taken like both of you are my are my adult son, adult brother, adult family. So I think I'm too protective and I want to apologize to that. That is why I keep repeating. Do you understand what you are doing? Because I know I uh, I am a person that see beyond what we are seeing now. Uh, this video today, I know how it's going to impact your life. Either it make you or it break you. Uh, the same thing with uh, Comrade uh, Umaro. I think Umaro we have uh, we have lost his communication. I don't think he's he's there. Let's see. Uh, we are going to bring him back again. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, we, we're gonna so whenever he gone back, we we'll bring him back. So I want you to understand. Uh I applaud your courage uh, to stand up for Governor Governor Obaseki. Uh sometimes I don't want people to make mistake or that push me to make. That is why you see my resistance. There are questions I would have asked. I don't want to do a got you question. This is situation room. I do not want you to plug Obaseki against Umaro. Neither I want tomorrow to plug Obaseki against you. So I believe you understand my my fair my fairness over here. So I'm trying to protect both of you. It's not that I think you don't know what you are doing or what you are saying. So uh, the uh, Chief Ezoba have just corrected me in that. So go ahead and uh, feel free. Uh, now uh, do, do it. Go ahead. Yeah. Thank you very much. I appreciate you, sir. Uh, as I've said before, I will estimate what I'm saying. Governor Godwin of Baseke is doing his best. Okay. I dare to say he day and night is doing his best. Okay. And he will continue to do his best. Okay. All the Edolai, all we need to do oh, is to try and to be with him to make the state great again. I okay. know when he's true with this tenor, Edo people will say, ah, we never knew that this governor know, know what he was doing. We hope so. so. Yes, we hope so. And I know what I'm talking about. Um, I know what I'm talking about. So when I talk, I know what I'm talking about. I don't come because I want people to love me or because I want to have friends. No, I know what I'm talking about. All I'm saying, let all Edolites join us together with the state governor to make the state great again. And I know at the end of it, I never knew that this man plan for us. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead, call us. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm hearing uh, yeah, I'm hearing what uh, hello. Don't listen to the video over there. When you call, you lower that one. I have a limited time, so I have a job. I have to go to work. When you call, lower the one you are using to watch me. I don't want to spend time telling you lower your, vi uh, your video down. Please. Hello. Hey, thank you, sir. Uh, I'm calling from Peter. I've been um, hearing what uh, some of you are saying, even some of the callers. Mm -hmm. I want to thank you for this platform you are using to be a blessing to people, uh, especially Nigeria and those people too. I believe we are here to help Nigeria or Edo people. We are not here to criticize any government. Let us put our hands on them to support them for the good, for the betterment of that country or of those states. 
it's not the we it's not the this time we begin to put uh we will drop by in our comments. Let's help the government. If I may say what some people will just call just to pour some wrong thing into the government that the government is not doing any type. I want to say this government have been doing better things. I've been hearing from uh, from social media, I've been hearing the good work they have been doing. When we begin to come to 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 platform or bloggers saying many things which is not right and they want to make sure that they are bringing the, the state governor that it is not fair it's better for we uh, like who you know so i love that man so loving mm -hmm. i love him i love him mm -hmm. you know if if, 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 if I, 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 I love, love him i love him i love him more than you i want you to know i love yeah, him more yeah. than you i want to say if you we put the government in a way that they will help us we say, ah, this road or this thing, they are not doing it. We we are here to support your your, your government. They will not help him. They will help okay. him. What is your what is your question? What is your question? Uh, what is your question? My, I don't have. I just want to contribute okay. to what you are saying because I just see in the platform that people are condemning the government is not doing. No, 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 no. Every they are not condemning him. Every country have a position. Hold on. The former government has been Hold on, my brother. That state uh, there's no, there's no road, there's nothing. But thank God for, uh, for this uh, governor now. He has been doing a better thing. There are some roads that okay, we heard you. Not we, but we, we, thank God for this man. He begin to. Okay, uh, go, go uh, Let's answer another call. Two minutes. Two minutes. Go ahead. Uh, good evening, sir. Yeah, uh, go ahead. Uh, yeah, sir. Uh, sorry, I just. I just called from, uh, I'm calling from Greece. My name is uh, Alex. Okay. Hello. Go ahead, two minutes. Hello. Two minutes, go ahead. Yeah. Sorry, sir. I just came back from Nigeria. Mm -hmm. Not barely three months. Okay. okay. Like the last caller that I just called you in, let me come down to the English everyone will, will really understand. Like the last caller we just called in. I can say that person never really visited those states for the past 10 years. Mm -hmm. Okay. I just came back from a two state. I post to Ui uh, Nusa. I'm not, I can't, I don't really know what to say. Okay. That is speaking this way. Because, sir, I will not lie to you. Everything Bobumaru is saying is truth. Okay. Okay. You have to my house in Sapa Road. Okay. Okay. I will tell you something from Ring Road. Name any place in Ring Road. Uh, 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 please allow him to finish his two minutes. Hello. You understand? Uh, go ahead. Everywhere is dark out, is black out in Bini. Apostle, you know, sir, if you are quoting me wrong, I will beg you, please, if you even want, I can send you money to buy gas on your car or fuel on your car, right? Send it. Just make a video tonight. You have 40, 40 seconds left. And Go ahead. Drive. Can you allow this man to finish his time? Eh? Go ahead. Where the government... Oh, God. They will not allow him to finish. Uh, don't worry. I'll give you back your foot. Can we react to that, that last caller? Let me react to that last caller. Can I? Huh? Let me, I want to react to that. They did not allow him Correct. to finish his time. Uh, uh, currently, cu currently, the state government, Obaseki, that is already installing street lights around the city of Benin. I, I have a, I have a on that. He's currently install, installing street lights around Benin. I went to Ring Road today. They are already fixing the street lights around Airport Road. They already fixed the fish line. The street that already fixing it. Then uh, uh, a Kewa road from an uh, upper market. They already the, the, the street light. How and can the they fix lights on a Kewa road that is under construction? A Kewa road is not even yet 30% completed. How can they fix uh, no, fish lights on it? Are we too dressed? Are we too dressed? Uh, no, there is no street light in the door. The father, you have to see with the government. And that is that is that is another life from the pit of hell. Why are you defending yourself, telling people I have issue with the governor? You are a pastor. I just told you I don't have issue with the governor. Why are you here? No, listen to me. 
You are deceiving the people. Why are you telling me? Why are you telling me? Why are you telling me I'm hitting people against the governor? What do you mean by that? That I have personal issue with the governor. Do I have that kind of issue with somebody I voted for? Did you travel? Did you travel 196 to 92 world with him? Did you cover 18 local government with him? Did you meet with the governor one on one only campaign? No, don't tell me that. You cannot come here and tell the people I have I have a personal issue with the governor. Who is the governor that we have personal issue with him? He's my servant. I voted for him because I, I sent him a message. So don't tell me that. The governor is the public servant, he's my servant. Don't say that. He's don't using that. our money. We sent him a message. Don't say that. That means you're not learned. You know nothing about government. That is what you are saying. That means you are, you are intellectually hollow. You know nothing about government. If you are saying the governor is not a servant, then you are wrong. You are wrong. Don't say that. Don't say that. You are wrong. Now, now listen. You are talking about street life. You are talking about street life. Governor, also a big street life in Esaco West. Are you aware that the governor has asked them to go and remove the street light in Africa West? Are you aware? Are you aware? Can you tell us? Can Ask him why the governor is removing the street light that governor told him. No, you ask him. It's Royal Barrow. The Barrow is gone. I am asking you now. Why is he removing street light from Jetu to Afawa? Is it not the same street light you are talking about? Governor, so many spent millions to fix those street lights. Today, Governor Gordon of Basaki gave order. And they have removed the street lights. Go to a donut, go and see. Go to a donut, go and see. You are not talking about street lights. Okay, tonight, go outside tonight. Go and video a street in Benin with street lights. Go and video the part of Benin that has street lights. Obasaki is not doing his best. Obasaki is a failure. And anyone supporting a failure is a failure. No, don't say that. It's a failure. It's a complete. It fight, yes. Okay. Okay, good. Okay, can I ask you a question? Mention five things that Obasaki have done in five years. Just five. I tell us the spot they are. Five. Oh yeah, let's go. A lot, a lot of things. Okay. Give us infrastructure. Let us know. Tell us infrastructure. Mention them. No, 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 no. Answer the question. Answer the question. Answer the question. Mention five things that Obasaki has done. I will mention five things that somebody did in five years. Mention five things that Obasaki did. Go ahead. I'm listening. Possible. What are the five things that Obasaki have done? In five years. Now, what, before you judge me. Now, okay, what I go said, ahead. What I said, and I mean it, as in this morning I went to Ring Road area. They are already installing the street light. No, what the are the five things? No, leave, leave street no, leave five things. Before the street light. Five things. Five things. Forget leave about five what he's doing now. What are the five major things have done? Go ahead. In the first turn, of how does keep build infrastructure? Like the what, are he did. what are the infrastructure? He built a lot of road that, that, we, that they never commissioned. A lot of road they it's not done. If it's a not lot. commissioned, it's out. A lot. A lot. How does keep doing his best? No, it's not making it. Hello? Hello? Yes. Good evening, sir. Uh, good evening. Go ahead. Uh -huh. I want to talk to our to you know, sir. Go ahead. What concerns the uh, uh, pastor with the uh, politics? Let me show this Bible very well. Pastor doesn't have to talk in politics. What do you mean? So we should leave politics for people to destroy. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Uh, our pastor is destroying it now. That's what she's saying. The Bible says when the righteous rule, the people rejoice. Now, if I'm not talking about politics, then okay. the people will continue. I want to show you people something. 372 Mitch call. You are saying 372 Mitch call. I cannot take all the call. Hello, okay. I want to have that. Hello. Oh yeah, go ahead. One minute. Two minutes. Go ahead. Two minutes. Hello. Yeah, two minutes. Thank you. Uh, Pastor, you are talking about the government and the people. You have two minutes. Go ahead. Can you speak the broken English, please? Hello? Broken English. Hello? You are with you. Broken English. Go ahead. Broken English. 
Okay, Boko TV. Okay. Okay, let me leave TV. What I'm trying to say is that, uh, Apostle, we appreciate you for coming to be a very It's of. not easy to come. But you can all receive us. <laughs> we already know what is happening. There are many emails. There are many breaking news on the on, on the uh, okay. internet. So what I I will appreciate you to affect your faith, and I want to appreciate uh, Umaru for coming out because Umaru has not come out. Yeah, believe me, it is well and it will be well. But Umaru has been got to understand that there is no road when there is no road. So we are taking that. So okay. as of today, all right, I'm thank you. To, tomorrow morning, go to Ekawa Road. Go to all the areas. There you believe the government is working for All right, thank you, thank you. Your what time is there? over. Thank you. Put it on. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. No, I am not mega, a mega, mega comrade. Mega yes, comrade. I, this place is getting I, dark for me. Can I just make my final submission so I can concentrate? My journey is still okay, long. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, thank you so much, sir. Um, Apostle, thank you for taking uh, the risk. Thank you for taking the risk to come and uh, challenge me. To come and not just challenge me, to come and challenge the truth on, uh, on PFM. I really appreciate your courage, and I pray that God will bless you. Amen. And I pray that God will bless you. My Amen. the final word is this: Apostle, Ekenwa Road is not far. Tomorrow morning, please go to Ekenwa Road. Take a, just one minute video of Ekenwa Road. I'm and going tell to send someone people. along with you. Yes, we'll do that. Good. Somebody will follow and tell you. A, yes, and tell those three people that the governor has done well. Okay, and uh, kindly again. Oh. Why, why you are uh, why you are covering a camera road? Hold help on. us Hold on. show us where the governor actually put street lights on the camera road. That is another one. Again, I have made another allegation that in a do not a circle west, governor Osomole has his own trademark. He has his signature, his street light, his roads, his schools. Everybody know his head sectors. We know how they are. Go to a circle west between Jetu to Afwa or Afwa. So ask people questions. If you have people, they tell them to video that place. All the street light in that as is has been removed. Mega company, you have people from a donut, and there are diasporans, uh, our brothers and sisters overseas, and our brothers and sisters that are watching us. Take your phone and call people from a donut. That Bob Manuel Umoru said that between Jetu Junction and Afa Show to Afawa, that they have removed the street light on the order of the governor, supervised by his deputy governor, that those street lights are no longer there. That I made such allegation that they, you want them to confirm it. I also want to inform you today that 70% of rural communities under Governor of Paseki have no access to primary health care. The ones that were built by Comrade Governor are in a dilapidating state, which are supposed to be constantly fixed by successive okay. government. Finally, okay. I want to say this. I want to say this. You may not be interested in what the state does. Or you may be interested, but whatever affects the state affects you. The insecurity is affecting me, it's affecting you. The hunger on our people, the hardship on our people is affecting us. We have to be true. I want it for the last time. Personally, God is my witness. I have no issue with Governor Godwin Obasaki. I see him, I'll give him my love, I'll give him my support. But as far as the people of Edo State is concerned, any pain that pinches my people pinches me. When my people cannot sleep, I receive the call. When my people are hungry, I receive the call. When the economy is bad, I receive the call. I have forwarded messages from Owa to Mega Comrade of the people calling yesterday, begging us that they should come and give their secondary school, begging us that they should bring teachers to their school, begging that their health centers do not have good uh, good infrastructures, begging us that they do not have light to even power their health centers at night, that they use thought light to treat emergencies. Is this what the people of Edote deserve? When the government got 58.1 billion in the whole of 2020, in the whole of 2021, by December, I will tell the beggar comrade and PFM family what has come into a dose state in the whole of 2021. The governor cannot hide it. Neither can the federal government hide it. It's the government have the right to, as a citizen of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Then, when it comes to protecting the governor, if the governor 
not get to the front burner of governance today. I am going to give you the assurance that my name is Omar Bume Bobmano Lumoru. I will take the courage to come here and give him kudos. And where he's not doing it right, I will come here and tell him he's not doing it right. I want to score the governor as a lecturer, as a teacher, as a mentor, as a bona fide citizen of a do state. I want to score the governor on performance for five years. For five years, I scored the governor five over 100. For the last one year, I scored him is zero over 100. If you want to see what the image of a faith government is, Governor Gordon of Basaki is the image of what a faith government is. I don't people, if I have angered any of you by my statement, by my utterances, I am not pushing you people to war, but I am telling you stand up for what is right. I am the proponent of the school of thought that says the power of the people is greater than the people in power. We elected Governor Basaki, we sent him a message, we are paying his salary, we are paying his everything that he needs to survive for the next for the eight years he's going to stay. So that makes him our servant. We have the right to call him to order. And when he refused to call to be called to order, again, I want to say it, I will mobilize the people of a do state and we are going to ask him question on a peaceful protest. It is our constitutional right. God bless every citizen of a do state. God bless our sisters and brothers in diaspora. Mega God comrade, you. God bless you. And Apostle Thank Uyi, God bless you. I love you. I love the courage you have come out with, but just that you came out at the wrong time. It is not good to come out at this point in time. You may take oh. a straight bullet of West from people like us. You have heard that better companies have had to stop people from insulting you. And those people are bleeding inside their heart. We need to look for an emergency section, I an mean, emergency uh, operation that will stop that bleeding of their heart. An emergency operation that will make them to be able to close their eyes and sleep at night. These are the things that we need to do now. You and I must come to the table and provide solutions. On security, I have provided solutions to the governor. And I have told him to call on the mega comrade and every other security expert. I have told him to copy neighborhood watch from Lagos. If Lagos could copy our Edo best, that a governor, governor of Asaki and his team change to Edo staff, then we have the right to copy their security architecture. God bless everybody and good night, sir. So I can concentrate on my driving. Yeah, uh, let me quickly come in before you leave. Uh, uh, Apostle, you know, sir, I love you. His battery is about to die too, right? And uh, Umaro is going to be here tomorrow. It's unfortunately, he came late. I want, I have uh, more than 700 missed calls right now. 700. What I can guarantee you people, uh, Apostle, you know, sir, is going to go to where we are going to ask him to go. And uh, after he come back, he's going to come back on air. Uh, Hold on, let me finish this. It's going to come back on here with Bobo Mario. We will now digest all this. Both of them are my son. I love both of them. You see, he said he love him. And uh, uh, Apostle, you know, so I love him too. So, Apostle, I go love ahead. Him and I, tonight, Apostle, I want to assure you tonight, I will do one thing. Every 12 midnight, I, I pray. 12 midnight, from 12 midnight to 4 o'clock is my prayer time, especially on days like this. I will put you in my prayer and I will put Governor Godwin in my prayer. I will ask God for mercy for you. I will ask God for mercy for Governor Gordon of Basaki. And I will ask him to give every one of us the sense to be brother's keeper so that we can tell one another the truth. I am your brother in Christ. I will never hate you for any reason. I will never incite people against you. But for the governor, tell him to get to the front burner of governors. Yes, by November 12th, we are going to shut down a door state and demand for what is ours. God bless you all. All right. Uh, Apostle, you know, sir, go ahead. Yes, thank you very much, my brother. Uh, I like that person. You don't have to speak. Hold on. 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 Go ahead. I heard what you said. You cannot go and pray for me that God should have mentioned on me because I have not committed any sin. You have, sir. I have not committed any sin. I want to say that. I that. No, I want to tell you something now. Hold on. On a lighter mood. On a lighter mood. Wait, wait, wait. Wait now. You came to wait, wait. Now. I want to Apostle is not ready. On a lighter mood. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. Apostle. Let me tell you. No. No, I just want to tell you this. I want to correct an impression. I want to correct an impression. Apostle, listen. Okay, if you said if you said if you said you have not committed sin, yes, you have. That is 
that is your father, Apostle. This is your father. The sin you are, no, no, like you will ask me which sin. The sin you have committed is Apostle coming to, to coming, coming to try and I deceive and adult people and defend what is not defending. You are the one that wants to cause crisis. They say, All right, uh, on a lighter mood, uh, uh, come in. By the grace of God, I am not a good I am not a good can you mute I your Maro? Mute yours and continue your journey. You know you're going to be on air tomorrow, Maro. So you can go. Umaro no. will be on air tomorrow. Go ahead. Mm. Now, when I talk, I don't talk with truth out of my mouth. I talk with wisdom because I'm not a foolish man. I am not a kid by the grace of God. If I tell you my age on, on air now, you will know that I'm not a kid. I may have a small body, but I'm not a kid. You understand? All I am saying let and don't people join hands together to make the state great. And the issue right. of saying governor has failed, I will not take that. The governor has not failed. You cannot call a result when the race is still on. No, you cannot give, you cannot call results when the race is still on. When the race is still, yeah. you cannot say, oh, let me give. But politics a, is different me, from that. What we're going to do, Apostle, sorry, I wanted you I'm to coming, sir. have it's I'm a coming, bad sir. time. I'm I have to book you for I'm another coming. day. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm five minutes. I'm mm. coming. Then some of your followers that choose to insult me, tell them that insult is going to be the apostle on the Amen. Times. Amen. Those, those your followers that is commenting and insulting me. It's not my no, follower. It's not my follower. You, Let me show you. I already blocked him. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me show you. I just blocked him. I sent the I put this number out there. I block him. What they did, they went ahead and used uh, whatever fake account. Uh, they are blocking them. That is it. They are not my follower. Those are enemies. Yeah. You know who they are. You. I don't want to say. I don't want to make sure his name here because you know that the publicity you are getting today is too much. They know it. Those are your enemies. That is it. Good. So, but uh, because they know. The, really? Let me tell you. They know the administration are watching. People are watching. The dignitaries are watching. And they saw it that Apostle, you know, say I've got in traffic here. They don't like it. Simple. Yes. So they are not my Thank follower you. at all. All right. Thank you very much. The truth is this. People may not like my personality. When I stand for a man, I don't see. I know there's follow person. I can't push them through it. It's not possible. And I don't be person. When it was called person with river, I can't dump her. I turn back. God forbid. And I keep saying it. I will continue to speak for Governor Godwin of Basaki and the area also need to say about do this thing. I don't need to come on air and begin to shout on Basaki. The, whether this is what this is what they call maturity. This is what they call maturity and relationship. If I have a relationship, you cannot expect me now. I now come and say, Governor Basaki, you are this. God forbid. Okay. God, God bless forbid. you. Uh, Apostle. God, uh, I want to let please now. Let me quickly tell you. Lao Baba, Lao 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 Lao. I will not have you. Why are you not even Lao? Why are you? You are doing well. They are all my fans. Uh, all I know there are my fathers, my mothers are all watching here. I'm begging you people. I have to go to work. I will bring Apostle back. I guarantee you. I will bring him back on air. Now, in five days, I guarantee you, we have to. I will make sure that the day I'm not going to work. You know what? Uh, we have uh, we have it, Doctor Pedro, if possible on Sunday. Uh, Doctor Pedro Baseki supposed to be here on Sunday. I will see how I can work with him. We can bring back Apostle Yinosa on Sunday, if possible. Will you be chance on Sunday? I'm always available by the grace of God. Good. So we have guarantee mm -hmm. on Sunday. Anything apostle, you know, so I want to say whatever call you want to make, we already have more than 800 call. Can you put it on Sunday? I am not working on Sunday. I'm already late. I am already late. I am begging every Edo citizen, please. My father out there, my mother out there. This is PFN situation. Apostle, you know, sir, I repeat again, I love him. It's my Edo son. Uh, Umaro, I repeat again, I love him. It's my Edo son. You see how I praise uh, Apostle, you know, sir, that his father is working. Those are the, those are the, 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 even we see that is on there. But yeah, we see, what do they call it in English? 
Go ahead. Go ahead and close the show. Go ahead. Right. On, a, on, on a very serious mm -hmm. on a very light mood, this is the time all adults are sundry must put them together with the state government to build the state. Unnecessary debate, unnecessary talk that will cause disharmony around court in the state is not needed and is not welcome. Okay. And I will not appreciate anyone coming to say that the governor has failed. The governor has not failed. Okay, you bring, your, you bring your proof on Sunday. Apostle, oh, uh, let's the close it here. I'm running off. I'm running off. So uh, yeah. all I'm saying, the governor has not failed and he will not fail. And some of those things he promised Edo people he will do. With God on his side and with the support of Edo people, he will do it. So let us join us together to make the state great. I mentioned Juhaya Kenyenye, it is not possible, and that cannot be my school of thought. I mentioned Juhaya Kenyenye, all I'm saying now, your platform is good, and this is the time we must use our platform to promote the interest and for the development of our state. And we try to transfer today, if it continues like that, I may not come to the show. We try to transfer, I may not come. But all I'm saying right now, without fear of favor, let us join us together to make a do great. There are a lot of things we need to do with your platform, with my platform, to make a do great again. And I know a do will be great again. And everywhere many people want to come back to the state, we will get there. Let's continue to pray. Let's continue to be patient. And no more fight. We shouldn't turn everywhere to snake. If there's snake everywhere, we cannot go anywhere. So the one Omar said is going to mobilize in June, whatever again. No, 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 no. Don't uh what let me clear one thing. Uh PFM uh have been on the ground for five years now. We have paid our price. If we bring anybody here, you should be honored that we 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 called you because not everyone we call. Uh, and uh, we uh, don't be surprised tomorrow. Don't be surprised tomorrow. He might not be here on Sunday. Why? Because of the love I have for him. I have people. I have a guy in Switzerland book on Sunday. We have Doctor Pedro who's, who, uh, who uh, is going to be coming here on Sunday. And I try to squeeze in him just to come and clear. I saw people commenting. We ask you five things that governor have done. You could not name me. I, I, I'm doing you a favor for you to come and tell you because the story will just go. Apostle, you know, sir, could not name one thing that the governor did. And you don't. Thank hold you. on. But me giving you the opportunity to come on Sunday and have time to do your research and come. I'm no doing problem. you a favor. No problem. Okay. No so problem. Uh, that, that, that is it. Are you going to be here on Sunday or no? We do not want why I cancel orders and you are not here. Yes or no? I'm here. I'll be here. Live on the road. That's good. So, guys, Adaruko, I love you. Put your hands together for yeah. Apostle you know, sir. Uh, please yeah. like this video. I am late at work. Uh, I'm sorry uh, that uh, too many calls came in. I'm already late. Next time, you all should share the video quickly. Please, comrade, it's a pity that you cannot speak again. Thank you so much. Tomorrow, I am on air with uh, Umario. I want to quickly show you a lot of people. You see another missed call again. So I love you guys. Please like this video. Uh, if you are on YouTube, we have about 1,000 people watching YouTube. Only 340 people like it. That is very, very bad. You see that? Only 340. Out of earlier. Now we still have 837 people watching on YouTube. You can see the like. You see? So... How can we have a thousand three hundred people and uh, people are not doing what they're supposed to do? So, well, I gotta go. I love you all. Please do not call me. Uh, tomorrow we're gonna be on air tomorrow. Uh, what we can do, whatever we can do to bring in those that are supposed to be here on Sunday, we are gonna do it. So, I love you guys. I gotta go to work. I love you all. Yeah, this is the situation where it happens. Uh, God bless you all. I love you all. Destiny, I love you. Uh, joy, joy, outstanding job. Fred, I do worry. I saw you. I love you guys. Please, I gotta go. I'm late already. I have not even eat, taken my breakfast. I gotta go. I love you guys. Thank you so much. I love you. Bye, yo. I see you all tomorrow. Get ready. PFN Situation Room. Thank you so much. Wow. It